Hey, hi, hello. Welcome to Tuesday Nights live on the couch here with Aussie Brick, Brick Chick. And Aussie Brick Work. <laughs> and no tech issues so far. Yay. What are we building? What are we building? Building Voltron. He's like, finally. I'm getting to it. We'll get the box down. Yeah, he drops it on his head. <laughs> it's, it's a decent sized box. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's eclipsing him. It's nearly as tall as Ninjago City. No, uh, Ninjago City's taller. Oh, okay. It was off the. Yeah, like the, I said, nearly as tall as. Geez, the aerials were off the screen. Like, listen to all the words that come out of my mouth. Mm -hmm. And of course, as always, <laughs> we've got some friends in the background. We've got Philip, aka Darkside Bricks. Howdy, howdy. He's busy writing his name on envelopes. <laughs> and we've also got Benny. Hello. Been a while. Well, on the stream anyway. Yes. Yes. New place good? It is. It is. I've now got the whole Lego room sorted, and I'm scared to take photos of it for people just in case I get ninjas breaking in. Um, <laughs> but it means that there's sadly no Lego in my room. It's all in its own dedicated room, which um, oh, I like to get off the door, Mike. You need to have a little, little filter into your room. Oh, yeah. I think I'll need... I've got some decor everywhere on my bookshelves and stuff. I've got, you know, just a tasteful uh, jar of bricks. Just <laughs> a tasteful. There's got to be some stuff. Oh, cool. Excellent. And you're all uh, psyched for your uh, trip o over the seas? Oh, my goodness, yes. I I get, like, adrenaline rush any time I go into great detail with someone what I'm doing because mm -hmm. it's just going to be the dream trip and I don't think I'll ever get over it. So it's it's going to be good. I can't wait. T minus, like, three weeks or something. Oh, my God. Well, I'm excited for you. <laughs> Thank you. Right, open the box already. Oh, wow. Then dump out parts and things and stuff. Yes, do the big upside down. Just don't knock the overhead cam over. So is this going to be a one night, one night build, Sean? Uh, I'm not sure. Depends on whether he lets me help. Yeah, well, if you let you help, it'll be a, what, three-week build. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, savage. <laughs> no, if I was savage, I would have said, and that's streaming every day, but I'll lift that part out. <laughs> You didn't now. <laughs> Where's that eject button? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Spong saying it's usually a three day build. Well, I guess we'll find out. Three. Uh, he's sorting his bag. Yes, this is super exciting stuff. So, how many bags have we got? Ah. Uh, at least 16, the highest number I've seen so far. Yeah. And some of the bags are really colourful. Like, clearly that's a yellow line, right? Green line. Yeah, bag one. Oh, yeah. Green line. Did I see the, uh, I think it was the Hogwarts Castle was up to, like, Bag thirty or forty or something on its yeah. It was a crazy amount of bags. I don't know if it was that much, but I know it was a lot more than I've ever seen. Yeah, I think it was thirty two, thirty one. I don't know. It's into the 30s. But like I was started doing just individual numbers per because there's the bags, it's not really Yeah. Like, in Jago City, there was, like, three bags of one, three bags yeah. of two, three bags of yeah. three. Going by numbers is is um, a falsehood, basically, because so many of them, you know, have multiple bags. Like, even the docks have multiple bags of numbers. Mm. Uh, I just want to take a moment to say hello to everyone in the live chat. Thank you for joining us. We love the company. Um, as... If you haven't watched this before, uh, this is what we do every Tuesday night to spend a bit of time together and yeah. uh, build. Um, we we had quite a shameful pile of things that we intended to build. 
That when he's getting built. The Lego guy's getting in early in the chat, by the way. Was he getting in? Where's your son? Um, he's not invited. <laughs> Whenever I invite him on a Tuesday, he never comes to join us. So never mind. Uh, all right. So we've got the Spongs in the chat. Lego guys in the chat. Martin M. Um, and Tassa Ped so far. And if anyone's like in the background, hello. Thank you for watching. Um, what's everyone so, building? Only five stickers and they're optional. Yeah. Which yeah. means they're never going to see the light of day. You don't have to put them on if you don't want to. Oh, really? Yeah. Which means they're never going to see the light of day. I don't know. I think the lines look better without the stickers. Oh, wow. Well, yeah, I didn't you know that, hon. Yeah, I kind of knew that. That's why people were saying, and this, we can help you. And I know that they were quite proud of that fact that it's only just those five stickers and the prints that are in the set are like nice and generic. They were they were quite chuffed at that on the video. Yeah. They were starting with yellow lines. Yeah. That was well. Book one. Okay. Book one. One book. Well, you sort of make the legs and then you make them torso yeah. and then you okay. make the arms. And you notice that he's not letting me build. The foot line's connected to the leg line. <laughs> the leg line's connected to the torso line. I'm currently building a 29-piece set, and it's going to be one of the biggest ones on my shelf somehow because it's a yard or set. The numbers that were the American version. Yes, that's why they had it. That's why they have the, the different the choice. The Americans are special. That was said with absolutely no sarcasm. <laughs> I have to because I love my American viewers. Of course. Ooh, turquoise. Turquoise. The turquoise. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. And of course, we have overhead cam. If it'll click, click, darn you. Oh, there we go. Look at that nice view. All that pretty, pretty, pretty yellow. Mm. And it's not primary yellow, it's that dark yellow color. It's more like... Um, Bright light orange? Yeah. Yeah. Which, yeah, you're right, it's pretty much just a yellow. Pretty much just a dark yellow, but yes, let's call it bright light orange because, Best you know... are going together. <gasps> Clickety-click, click, click. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Knew what was going to happen. I wrote the word yellow because I was listening to you talking. <laughs> 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 oh, no! <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. So now I'm um, dark side yellow instead of dark side bricks. <laughs> dark side yellow bricks. Yeah, whoever gets that envelope when they place an order, if they watch this video, they'll go, oh, I know when he filled that out. <laughs> Fresh edition, me buy it. Yes, yes. <laughs> It'll be, be super, super collectible. Collectibles. Well, hopefully by this Friday night stream, mm. my table will have been test fitted or maybe even permanently in my travel box. Yay. Yay. Which means the table will be finished, thank God. I, I saw that you almost finished. Oh. <laughs> I watched yes. your whole your whole video. I haven't commented yet because I fell asleep afterwards. Oh, well, it is fairly boring. No, no, I started watching it when I went to bed because I was like, oh, Dark Side Bricks, I should watch this. <laughs> the last video will be probably the longest video, but I plan on thanking a hell of a lot of people on that video from people that inspired me through the actual buildings like Brick Nader and his landing bay and a few others. And um, I'm going to have a big line of um, credit, line of credits for Bricklink stores and everyone that I've brought from that have helped me make the table. Ah, cool. So a bit of a free splurge, um, a free blurb on there for the stores that have helped me out. 
free blurb. And for anyone that doesn't know, Darkside Bricks is a brickling store. He also has himself a channel on YouTube. So go and subscribe because he's got good Star Wars stuff. I posted another lounge room build too. The UCSY week. Ah. Whenever Mel and I um, build something together, it's always in the lounge room. So mm -hmm. I decided I'd start calling them lounge room builds. Same here. Yeah, yeah. But I have recalled them in hyper, hyper, um, yeah, in speed. Like, um, time lapse. Time, yeah, hyperlet, um, hyperlapse. That's mm -hmm. what Samsung calls it. And um, yeah, I post them as speed builds. And normally I have a review at the end, just a real quick review of my thoughts. But I didn't get one done for the Y wing. And you can't see it from here, but it's up there. It's just a very thin strip. Yeah. <laughs> you can't really it see it. It kind of blends in. I, I yeah. know what it looks like, so I can see it. Ah, oh, it's all good. What are you building, Bailey? Um, well, there's no instructions for this set, so I'm kind of going off the box art. Oh, and none of the pictures on the box art actually match each other, so I don't know what I'm. <laughs> You're just like I'm just making it up. Kind of coming together, like four-legged, got two arms. Insectoid. The head will come at some point. Oh, that's cool. definitely insectoid. Well, you're not wrong. It's like an ant-looking character in the TV show was sort of spawned out of the ba the main villain's like mind and most of them took the shape of some sort of insect and a bunch of them were flying and that one definitely looks like an ant the face the head yeah the sort of mandibles and everything going this is yeah his name is uni it's just a great name <laughs> uni oh that looks cool i like it Yeah, no, that looks suitably horrific. It looks like something that should be in Jabba's palace underground. <laughs> for yeah, or at the very least, living in the um compactor, the trash compactor on the Death Star. <laughs> yes, try to be best friends with the uh with the, di with the Dian Ogre. Oh, he does have a name. I was going to ask. What yes, it's name called, yes, it's called a Dian Ogre. A dying ogre, hey. A dying ogre. Close enough. <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, so, uh, is there anyone that's watching us in the live chat, uh, are you building or are you sorting or are you just hanging out? Let's know. <laughs> We've started um, changing a few things around the house and trying to get things be better organised for the store and for stock and everything. Yeah. And Mel's um, been raiding all my plastic tubs that I don't have to use now because I've got the travel box and everything. And um, I'm, I'm wondering what I'm going to do with the little shelving, the little shelves I had in them. I don't know if you can see it, if I can get out of the way enough. Yeah, like little... Right behind me, right in the middle shelf, I've actually got one sitting over the top of my modem and all my first order stuff sitting up on top of it. Yeah. So it's actually freed up, like, it's given me that much of the shelf for free. Base. Yeah, yeah. so to build, basically display things over the top of the modem, which is good. Extra space. Well, I want to move the Y-Wing down to my UCS level shelf. I can't say shelf anymore because the shelf itself's is full. Um, so, yeah, I need to make that whole level of these shelves all for UCS. Because I've got a funny feeling there might be more coming. Well, there'll always be more coming. Well, I've got to hurry up at least four feet at some point. Four feet. For the Super Star Destroyer. Ah, <laughs> uh, hey, Henry. Because I will get one eventually. He says, sorry, won't be able to watch. Have an absolute crap ton of assignments. We'll be able to watch next week. 100% have some, though. What assignments? Hey, Henry. Good work comes first. What subjects, Henry? Uh, he's probably just popped in and popped out. You might watch this by. Oh, 
Okay, making progress. Yeah. Good. So I'm a bit of a noob with Voltron. Mm -hmm. uh, when did it sort of become a thing, at least in the West? I thought I remember watching it when I was a kid. Yeah, I think it's. Uh, but I hated it then too. So. Uh, the original was like. The was it out in the thirties, Philip? <laughs> we, used to, we used to chisel it onto the walls of the caves. Thank you very much. <laughs> you were saying, Sean? The the voice acting in the original is um very cringeworthy. Oh yeah, I'm sure the voice of the speech is like, oh my god, why did that? Why did they pick that poor, poor person? Why did they make them do that voice? Yeah, it's just the most irritating voice you've ever heard. <laughs> I used to remember watching Voltron and um, G Force. G Force, I'm familiar with. Not seen it, but, but that was only because they were on before the goodies and Doctor Who. So <laughs> I, I vaguely remember the goodies. Yeah, That's disgusting. I, must admit, I watched Voltron a couple of times as a kid that I at least remember. So at least I know what this is. I've been definitely getting a lot into the the Netflix. The new, yeah, the, the new one. Our Lego guy says he's building a train. I didn't find that very surprising at all. Uh, well, that's tw that's twenty five done. I don't want to do any more. Oh come on, you can get to fifty. I believe in you. <laughs> <laughs> My wrist doesn't. Oh RSI. Yeah. Never mind, never mind. I think one thing that would have made this set absolutely awesome is if they had included the minifigs. Oh, then they probably would have had to have made it bigger. Oh, even if they just, it was sort of a standalone-y. Oh, like well, they, they did, they did the, with the heli carrier. Yeah, and the um, Ghostbusters and... Yeah, it does feel like a missed opportunity, but I guess that might have been maybe extra leverage for the licensing to charge more. I don't know. All very complicated stuff. Mm. There it is. It is not long now till Maribara. Yes, I know. I Three weeks. Not long now. Three weeks to go. Nice. Yeah. We we get we get to be roommates. Yep. All taking, of us, not just me and Phil. Taking stalking to a whole new level. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's another one classed as a regional show, yeah? Hey? It's another one classed as a regional show. Yeah. Could be a yeah. good one. Yeah. Well the one you went to you had fun. Oh yeah. That was one of the best times I've had of anything like that. Yeah, it's the best one. Finished with one more character. This one is Nepal. It's a little... The actor is a dwarf, if that gives you an idea for his scale compared to the rest of them. <laughs> but I don't quite know if he's like a wizard or if he's just got some magic powers because it's the future, but got a nice little staff. He has a weird belly button. He does. It's a little odd. I um, think it's an innie. <laughs> so he is. It's a all the way through. He's got he's got a nice little beer belly. It's <laughs> What's the TV show? Galador. Oh, okay. And his posture isn't his posture's not great. <laughs> oh, God. And he's really moody in the show, so his play feature is that his eyes can squint. Oh, oh that's cool. That is actually cool. One of the um, local stalls at the local flea market here in Bundy has had a Galador bo Lego box set for sale for like 20 bucks or 30 bucks or something for like, really? three, for like three months. Oh. I keep doing it and I go, no, nah. <laughs> keep moving on. <laughs> Happen to know what set it was? Oh, I couldn't tell you, but I'll uh, make a mental note to actually check it this Sunday. It's probably gone now. You watch, but I'll make a mental note to check it. If it's there, I'll offer them ten. 
No, no, no. No, tell them they can pay you five dollars to take it away. Yeah, that's that was my first thought. Because I'm closing in on having a complete boxed and loose or sealed and loose collection. All uh, I can tell you is the box is about yay wide, about yay thick, about if I can get it on the screen, about yay high. Yeah, that'd be about oh, right. It's, it's fully probably, black, fully black with the Lego logo and Galador written like that across the cover. It would probably be one of these then. Um, these, well, the set that this comes with and this set were both the only ones that came in a box that size, so it's likely one of those two, I would imagine. Actually, I wonder if I could do a search for Galador on Google and see if it brings up all the boxes or the sets. Um, Maybe something cool. Yeah, one. that's what I was thinking. The mm. red one is Uni, double O-N-I. I'll know by the picture before I know by the by yeah. the box picture before I know by names. Oh yeah. I was looking at the I have pieces. a feeling if it's one that's Bailey's after, you'll be um You'll be buying it. You'll be tasked with a mission. Yeah. Oh, I'd have to <laughs> check it. I'd have to check and see if it's all there and I mean, full, full disclosure, I've already got both, but at that price, they'd probably just be good for spare parts anyway. Yeah, make some fun stuff. Your mission is to be to accept it to buy all the Galador. Buy all the Galador. They do have interesting hearts. Yeah, this is the body of the current one that I'm working on. It's like a camel type thing. There's enough connections to do a lot of interesting stuff, and they're just ratcheting, you know, socket joints like you're in Exoforce and dinosaurs. <laughs> yes, dinosaurs. You could fit a set of T Rex legs and arms onto these. Yeah. You can make your own hybrids, honey. So I should. Yes, yes. I have been sort of kicking ideas around my head on what to do next. Well, the whole thing with Jurassic Park and then Jurassic World was experimenting on the natural order of things. Mm. I think we need to see a uh, ABC world. Jura Jurassic... No, I can't come up with a pun. You figure out the name. <laughs> but mixing all the different... Uh, systems uh, like those creator dinosaurs the technic dinosaurs duplo lego to try and mix your own with galador and make like a almost a science center with different dinosaurs that would be that could be interesting an interesting take a new take i was also thinking something along the lines of like a alternate history sort of um oh, yes the kind of Type thing where dinosaurs and people like, you know, like they use dinosaurs and <laughs> like horses and elephants and stuff like that. Yeah, as if they still existed and were tamed like any other stock. Mm. That would be cool. Yeah, I've seen some interesting stuff on Flickr. Uh, um, yeah, I, I, my problem is, is that uh, my aspirations and my Lego collection do not match at the moment. <laughs> um, Jeff's been talking with me about the possibility of doing a collaboration. Well, that's what LDD's for. It's for the rainy day builds. Yeah, but I want to. I want to actually make something come to life, like properly. And I'm not very good at LDD. What is, uh, Adam is in the chat saying, "Off in the morning to do a big Lego shop." Lol. Good for you. It's a pension day. It could be actually. <laughs> it was last week. Mm. I can't see anything there that's jogging my memory, but there's um, um, I saw one picture. Whatever is it? Of a weird shaped box. It's like it's like a skinny box and a big box, but they're joined at the side. Does mm. that make sense? Oh, I know the one. Yeah. Yep, that rings a bell. Ooh. But it's not the box art that I'm looking at at the moment. Oh, okay. There's actually oh, that... two different variants of that box. 
keep your eyes on on your messenger on Sunday morning, Bailey. Okay. Thank if you. it's there, I'll take a photo and I'll PM it to you straight away. So it'll be between nine and eleven, nine and ten, nine and eleven, Sunday morning. I, um, I work on Sundays, but uh, I mean, depending on the price, I could probably just send you some money tentatively beforehand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you wanted it, I'd, I'd just grab it and you can fix me up afterwards. That's not a problem. But I want to make sure I send you a photo and you can see, or photos, so you can see what's there, what's not, the condition, blah, blah, blah. All right. Thank you. That's all right. If I can't do that for a fellow A4, what, what am I worth? You're worth plenty, fellow. No, not if you can't do the things to help people. That's what I'm saying. Everyone's in a position to help. Anyway, are you getting somewhere yet? Yeah. Yeah, that, that's what I meant, Sherry. If you're in a position to help, what yeah. sort of person are you if you don't? Mm. I'm up here so far. I'm, I'm disappointed that you're not doing it faster. Why is that? Yeah, why is that not finished? I thought you'd be on to the second one, but third yeah, one by now. Like, usually you're just like boom, 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 boom. Oh, he's slowing down so he can enjoy it. This is why I'm not allowed to build it. Ah, uh, because he actually cares about this one. Yeah. From what I've heard <laughs> about the, the build techniques and things in this set, it's definitely one worth slowing down and enjoying. Mm. I liked, Hello. speaking of build techniques, I liked the um, build techniques, some of the build techniques in the Y-Wing, in the UCS Y-Wing. Mm. It uses the um, bricks with the, the headlight bricks. Mm. But it uses them laying down. It uses them upside down. You're not connecting them normally. Ah, yes. So yeah, it's got a lot of uses of those in a in a sideways type position. Mm. What are you doing, Drist? You're not meant to be in here. <laughs> I snuck in. He had, <laughs> come on out. He looks like a storm like, cat. How he could sneak no anywhere cat. is beyond me. There is no cat. <laughs> oh no, there is a cat. There's lots of cat. Hello, Drist. Go on, mate. It's I forgot ABC. It's there's a cover on the set for his belly button. Oh. That's <laughs> is a bit of a loincloth dong flap thing, but dong flap. <laughs> it covers the, uh, covers that little spot. Oh uh, no, it doesn't quite fit on no, the. No, he's not the quite camera. so holy. No. There you go. It doesn't quite fit on the camera. <laughs> Oh, God, it's a good set. So big. It is awesome. It's so big. It is. It is unreal. The Red 5 X-Wing is one of the few sets that I regret selling. I'd love to have kept it and have this next to it. Oh, yeah. I actually saw one, a guy selling one that's been opened and built once and left on display in his house for 280 bucks. Ooh, on Facebook, it's yeah. like, oh, so tempted. Oh, we've got the red pipe, haven't mm -hmm. we? Shh. It's over there. <laughs> <laughs> she loves reminding me every time. Yeah, well, at least it's on the background of all the all the um, live streams like it used to be. No, that's right. That's why you've lost, lost viewers. <laughs> oh, because I don't have soul as mine. <laughs> Yes, I do. I got brickheads. I put all the stuff. <laughs> Not that you can see them at the moment because you know, I had to tilt the camera down so that you can actually see the table. Oh, and this Y wing is so swooshable. <laughs> oh, I actually had it and my UCS Tie Fighter in my hands, and I was playing in the hallway, and I think I strained my forearm muscle. <laughs> I twisted my arm, and I got this sudden pain in my arm. Oh, you're getting too old to swoosh. Bloody TIE fighter. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, I do actually play with my Legos. And, yes, I was pew, pew, pewing. Pew, 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 pew. I'm such a child. I don't care. Who knows? We weren't told Dark Side that I nearly got the um, Super Star Destroyer. What, when, who, how, where? The same. Uh, would have been about the same time I got the Red 5. Oh, okay. I almost put it on. Here's I wanted to put it on lay-by, but someone said no. This is back when I had a bit more self-control. 
That's the voice way to do that. Oh. <laughs> put the sea cow on lay by too. Yeah, I mean. In, We're going to put on a big um, in Christmas In my lay-by. defense, yeah. he was buying all the big sets that year. It would have been about $1,200. Like a crazy lay-by. amount of lay by. And uh, I will get I will get myself an SSD one day, and it's my next dream one. I got my Death Star, so now I just got to save up for the SSD. Just over two weeks to the show. It's not just over two weeks, is it? Two and a half. It's the twenty second and twenty third. So whatever that is. Fourth one. Shh. So bad. I'm gonna have to express post things. Well, get things express posted. I'm not going to be busy on the weekend. I'm going to be busy for quite a few weeks, honey. So from this Friday, you've got next Friday and then the Friday after that. And you've got to be in Maryborough on that Friday to set up. So, yeah, you've got one, two weeks and two days. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm going to hurry up and get this thing fitted. We just test fitted the box in my car. I've got to pull my um, front seats a little bit forward just so I'm uncomfortable driving. <laughs> oh, no. So luckily, I'm only going to Maryborough. Yeah, it's only and, and I won't have Mel with me, so I'll be able to stack heaps of stuff in the front of the car as well as the back. <laughs> so I can have her seat forward as well. It's not much. It's like it's just I notice like I've got it in position now so I can get used to it. And it clicks onto all that to uh-huh. catch it. And this is the end where it turns up. And I'm going to have to do that modification mm. that, that someone did that actually allows the, the feet to stand level instead of slightly. Yeah, you can do that after. Just hurry up and build it. Yeah. <laughs> ah, dear. I'm just impatient because I'm not allowed to build anything. You can play with it? Oh, I'm allowed to play with it. Wow. I should be deconstructing right now. I'm going to deconstruct a whole bunch of old castle sets mm-hmm. that belong to my son so I can get some shelf space back. I was say, hello, David H. Watching in Hong Kong airport on return to Australia. Ooh. Cool. Oh, I'm glad we can be entertaining. Yeah. <laughs> Just hope you don't get stuck there for six months. Oh, like that guy in yeah, the guy in the That's shocking. Have you heard? Uh, it's barely there. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear that story about the guy who got stuck in the Malaysian airport and lives there? He's, uh, yeah. He's been there for six months. It's almost the same as the um, Tom Hanks movie. Mm. Yeah, pretty close. For as stupid as our government is, I'm glad we're not in a situation where that would happen to any one of us. Mm. Yeah, you would hope. That's most of the structure of the yellow that, line done. Is that a line? Yeah. It will be. Next okay. Part, um, the head that's going to slide into there. Oh, okay. So, and then the last ones will be the legs that attach on the... Oh, so that's the body, is it? Yes. Yeah, that's the body. So I've got the yeah. head. Thought it'd be bigger. Back two is the head and back Actually, three are all the legs. It's probably as big as I expected, but I've seen the actual model together because yeah. it was a dream world. Of course, you can go to dream world any time you want. You can go to dream world. What do you mean any time? It's very You don't have a five-hour drive. That's what I mean. Hey, it's a long drive for us, too. <laughs> it's five hours for us. Round trip. <laughs> Round trip, Yeah. <laughs> I've got to take no dose if I want to make a round trip. Your brother-in-law is going, hurry up. Interesting that they're using turquoise. Mm. I almost want you, to like... Do you have to remind me what the piece is that Bailey's after? Huh? Oh. It'll, it'll be a spare, so it'll just be whatever's left aside. Yeah, was, was that the chrome one long... One, one length bar with the hook on the end? Was that the part? The one by one round plate in light blue gray with the bar off to the the end of it, yeah. Hang on. Oh, that way I can keep you. an eye out for it and not put it into our table scrap spin. Oh, I'm sure it won't be that hard to find there. 
It, it's an odd enough part that you'll probably take some notice of it as you come up to it. Being chrome helps. If everyone was in such chatty Cathy's in, in, in our group chat, I'd be able to find the... He posted a picture, didn't he? Just click on any photo and then that should bring up all the photos that have been posted in our chat and you can find I, it. I can send it back to you now if you want. Let's go, bam. There, oh, it, there is. it is. That's it. Oh, that piece. Oh, that piece. Have you seen that piece yet? No, I'll just, I recognise it. Okay. So yeah, I don't know where it actually is in the set. I know where it is in the um, Aston Martin. It's to hold the um, mirrors. To hold the mirrors. They used it in um, a brown version in the Olaf. Yes. Head for his ears. Yeah. Brown version. We'll just have to try and figure out how to get it to you. I just keep finding pictures of cats and chickens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that uh, dominates it. In our um, in well, our Lego chat. Yeah. yeah. And root fruit. <laughs> root fruit. <laughs> and flowers. Okay, I I do not post those sorts of pictures at all. Uh, Sean Ross just sent it in an envelope. Um, I can pay you for it and a stamp if you'd like. <laughs> yeah, we'll work out something. Yeah. I just don't want it to get lost by Australia Post. Mm, considering how rare it is. Then then we'll just have to build the Aston Martin next week. <laughs> Good enough excuse as any. <laughs> you build the Aston Martin next week and you'll be sitting on this couch alone. <laughs> Right, what do you want to build next week? I don't know. Maybe something that I find interesting. Maybe. I don't know. We'll figure it out. It's up for debate. Mm. We've got a week to debate about it. Mm. Keep looking at all these turquoise bits that are clearly going to end up being hidden. Oh, yeah. Half of mine to just swap them out. Yeah, switch them for like a... If you got spare, uh, just greys or something. Yeah, it's kind of not visible. The I think it's just random... to differentiate so that it's easier to build. Yeah, so it's not all one colour. Yeah. It's, it's so that you can see where the pieces go. Mm. I see they've used a bunch of it in the Unikitty set <laughs> as well as the minifigs. And so I think I'm going to stock up on that. That one that comes in like the... Uh, Creator box, the white creator box. <coughs> we'll grab that. Mm. I had a thought. I'll be back. Okay. Got to grab something and some batteries. <laughs> okay. <laughs> something and some batteries. Mm. Sounds interesting. He's got one of the Galdor sets that has the voice back ability. Oh, God. I'm it, guessing. And I only know that because of looking for the at the Galador boxes just before. Oh, you're saying he's only got um, two. Uh, just wish I could remember which one it was. Mm. I don't think he'll probably just ask you to just get it for him anyway. <laughs> probably. Uh, why does Lego waste a good colour inside the kits? Um, I think it's because when they brought in the, the, the teal or whatever it's called, um, I guess they have to use it a certain percentage in, like they have to use enough of it to make it worth making it. Yeah, that makes sense. So they or have to they put gonna, it in places. So yeah, they're going to cast all these parts. They probably need to cast a, say, a million parts. Yeah, to yeah. make the run worthwhile, and then they might they might only use nine hundred thousand of them and they still have a hundred thousand left to use. So. Yeah. So you'll probably find that in during the design process they're probably told you need to um use, you know, some of this colour somewhere in the inside of the build. It's also to so um kitties can um see what step they're up to when they're building. Yeah, yeah, we already And did. and us noobs too. Yeah, it's a help sort of break up uh, if you're just looking at dark grey in the whole for a whole build. It probably yeah. looked a bit um hmm. Star Warsish. I mean uh <laughs> that too. Star Wars da, 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 Star Wars. Da, da, da. What's this big W this Thursday? 
let's turn this build stream into an information stream. <laughs> uh, the Star Wars Cloud Rider bikes and Anakin Starfighter are going to be $39. Thro Snoke's Throne Room, $79. Oh, the X-Wing Fighter back down to $99. Harry Potter car, 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 Hogwarts, 129. Harry Potter, Whomping Willow, 79. Harry Potter, Quidditch, 39. There you go. That's what Lego is going to be on sale, Big W, this Thursday. Thursday, 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 Big W, 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 not sponsored. You know what I really don't like is I can't buy something online at Big W, use PayPal to pay for it, and then pick it up at my local store. They don't allow that? Nope. Because my local store says, no pickup available. Really? Yep. Are they too small to facilitate it? Because I'm in the sticks. No, that's, no, our Big W is just as good as any city Big W, that's for sure. Actually, I often find more in our Big W than I do when we're down in visiting Brisbane. Yeah, but to, like, how big's the, you know, reserves and lay-by section and whatnot? Oh, I have no idea. I wouldn't know what it's like out the back, but... That's the side of it that matters with um, facilitating those sorts of services. Yeah. Does it have lay-by? Yeah. Oh. It has all, it has all of that. My, my y wing was on lay by, and my wife decided to get it off lay by for me for Father's Day prezzy. <laughs> and tease you. sorry, and tease you with it. Yes, no, she, you cannot have till Sunday. She was a brick tease. A brick tease. <laughs> oh, David H, who's in Hong Kong airport, says, Have two backpacks with me, one is full of Lego. So, wait, which color is that? So, we know which one to grab off you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the problem is, is that you don't know which airport he's coming back to. That's all right. There's enough AFOLs in Australia. We can cover them all. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, we wouldn't deprive an AFOL of his Lego, would we? Hell no. Willingly. Willingly. <laughs> uh, what, what did you grab, Bailey? I, uh... In this bulk lot of the Galador stuff, I got a Keck Powerizer, which is a giant two, three, four, five, six piece set that's electronic. Um, and Ooh. I hadn't put any batteries in it yet. Um, and I was wondering why it wasn't working, but realized they probably had the same batteries in them since like 2004. Is that the thing with the voice back feature or whatever it says on the box? Yes. See, I was right. Yes. So I'm going to see. If Only I... because I don't just finished looking at all those boxes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to see if it works. Oh, my God, it does. It does. It does. Oh, that's awesome. Hang on. I'll see if I can. The microphone's in the front. Corium activated. Oh, my I'm God. <laughs> oh, my God. It still sounds crystal clear. It's crystal clear. I am activated. Is that all he says? He's got C3PO's oh, voice. No, there's, there's all sorts of stuff. He's got different commands on the back. You can cycle. Oh, press buttons, press buttons. Oh, hello. <laughs> Sounds like a dodgy V8. <laughs> the only thing is, there's no off button. Oh, no. No. Rip his head off to stop it. That's the off button. Yeah, rip his head off. Rip his head off. <laughs> right. or, just, or, or once you put him together, just don't press the on button. It, it's like this. As a mum who's had a child and, and has had, like, nephews and nieces, oh, my God. Okay. I used to be that auntie that would buy all the noisy toys. And, like, when they returned the favor, I was like, oh, damn. Oh, yeah, payback's a bitch. Payback is a bitch. 
Look at the look on, on Bailey's face. It's like, it works! It works! God damn it! The thing is, um, this this toy, it can talk to the TV show, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. The ones on YouTube are too low a quality, I think. But they also talk to each other. Hi. If you've got another one of these. Oh, wow. And I have another one of these. <laughs> you got to go and turn them both on, dude. I'll see if I've got any more batteries. <laughs> Mom, do we have any more batteries? Well, that won't work from his new place unless his mum lives real close. Huh? He still lives with Oh, he's him. still there? I thought he was actually in a new place. They moved. That's why he has Ah. Uh, ah, uh, Adam says, a thousand Apple points to Dark Side, lol, for knowing that it was the thing for the voice. Yeah, well, that was pure luck. <laughs> Yeah, so it was pure like um luck. <laughs> there was no skill involved. Very, very quick um research on the Googles. <laughs> Accidentally saw a picture of a box with a sticker on it. That like, said no, voice no, that said voice back. Thing. Oh my god, I can't believe it's so many. Although I've got um dinosaur from like, you know, the early two thousands that still lights up, that has the light up eyes. And so many people I've seen do videos have said, oh, the eyes don't light up anymore. Mine do. Speaking of, something I need to check batteries for. Uh, Where is it? Where is it? Yeah. Building. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh. He, he's made a head. The he's yellow got, lion's head. He's gotten a little ahead. Wow. Ooh. That's a good shape. I like that, I mean, they're all pretty much the same sized head and most of the same parts, but just little details sort of change the look of all of the lion heads. Hmm, definitely. Something from my son's Lego collection. Ah, uh, yes. His, his, his Dark Side developer kit. Sponsored. And we haven't tested it out yet to see if the um, the brain still works. Uh, good morning, Charm City Brick. It's about time you joined us. <laughs> I know it's early. It seems we're, we're, we're building new things and opening old things. Probably need to get your hands on the droid development kit, Darkseid. Mm. What does a piece of paper say? Galador. Congratulations on your purchase of the Keck Power Riser. This exciting toy will be the power will have the power to interact with the TV show. Galador, Defenders of the Outer Dimension, starting August 31st. Be sure to watch Galador on its new network, ABC Family, beginning September 14th. Every Saturday and Sunday, and unleash the true power of the Keck Powerizer. <laughs> Exciting. Now, what kid wouldn't like that? I'm just looking at the dates going. That's like a year ago. Oh, this time of year when it was first released. Yeah. Yeah. And that was released. Yay. 20, uh, 19, 18 years ago, something. How old is Galador? 2002. 16 years ago. That would explain why I don't know anything about it. I wasn't born until late 2003. That's when I started watching random things on television out of boredom. <laughs> no, I don't have any double A batteries. Not actually. Well, I do. They're in my costume bag, so I don't feel like burying myself under the table to get them. Oh, that's got some um, erosion in there. Mmm, battery acid. Get on. Battery acid, bad. It is cleanable, right? As yeah. so long as you got the right stuff. Yeah. Sometimes you don't need to. Like, you get the battery out and give it a, a rub with a wire brush, and it usually comes good. To be fair, how old is this set? The battery was in it since the day you got it. Oh, dear. 578 pieces. There's a reason why they tell you to take the batteries out. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sound yeah. like my wife. <laughs> she must be onto something then. She must yeah. be an awesome lady then. As I said to her, she didn't take the bloody batteries out either, so shush. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and at that time, she was the one who was at home with the kids. I was working, so I've got an excuse. What's this? Them's biting words. Oh, we've got a missings list. A missing that's not too bad. Something that's that old is only missing that much stuff. What, 10 pieces or something? A missing list. 12 pieces. Made a list of missing. What's this? Uh, Tom City Brick says, this last weekend I spent like half a day cleaning out from underneath my table and I was like, holy crap, I didn't even realise I had some things. Lol. Yeah, I know that feeling. <laughs> Wasn't that one of your streams from like three months ago where the stream started up and I went, uh, exclaimed how excited I was because I've got a floor in my room? <laughs> I didn't know it existed before then. Like, what's a floor? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. I would love to get to a point where I don't know I have things in my collection. Like, I've pretty much got tabs on everything I own. Everybody thinks I've got this huge collection. Yeah, you've seen it. It's yeah. really not that big. It's because you collect expensive things badly. Well, I don't collect small things. Small expensive things. Other than giant electronic robots. <laughs> or, or two of them. That talk to each other. <laughs> It's just so cool. <laughs> I know. It's like watching a kid discover a toy. That okay. So, Mr. Star Wars, it's like the uh, the ones that they've got for Star Wars at the moment where you wear the wristband and the action figure, like, talks through the wristband thing. Yeah. It's just an older version of that. Yeah. Is it on? Oh, yeah. Okay. My brother is reminding me that I have a whole room upstairs of. Okay. <clears throat> we have a whole room upstairs that's full of stuff that used to live in the garage because we moved out of a how many bedroom house? Four, four, four bedroom house into a three bedroom townhouse. So massive downsizing. So um, there was stuff that's just been packed away that we've not been able to really bring out or use or haven't gotten around to getting, you know, disposing of. And then. Yeah, our Lego collection has exploded. <laughs> right, I'm going to put myself on mute until I work out how to <laughs> all these things. No worries. Okay, that's so, cool. This is lying so far. Oh, that looks better. Um, you, could show, his... you could show the overhead cam. And the head. Oh, no, that's the body, that one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So we, um, we've just got the legs to go on this one now. So is the head of the line the head of the... The head of Voltron, or, or is the head of the line the, the foot? So this one's the that's one, one of, of the feet. feet. So the yellow line's not the body; it's the feet. No, the black line's the body. Yeah, that's what I thought. When you said before that the yellow one was the body, it's like what? Huh? This is no. the body of the yellow line. The body of the yellow line. So he confused me with these words and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't take much, trust me. My brother's saying, I bet there's a gold mine up there. There's a lot of stuff up there. I went I went digging around upstairs in the in the spare room for stuff um last weekend to do that um dinosaur display. And yeah, let's just say that I found things and gotten buried. <laughs> it's a problem. Oh, I'm enjoying seeing the Skeletor style. Yeah, I think I know where there's some batteries. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to find batteries. He's got one of these figures too, I bet. <gasps> Does I, don't know, I don't know how they work, so I've got the manual out. Oh, my God, it's a man reading a manual. Woo! No. <laughs> sure, horror. And I do not mean that in a sexist way at all. No, not at all. Not at all. I just, I, 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 I haven't met very many of the male persuasion that actually read. In What's the male persuasion? Yes, That's... male persuasion. Cameras can send signals. 
Sure. No further than one meter apart. That should be fine. And are facing each other. Uh, Chumsey is saying, does anyone have any ideas on some steam engine instructions? Ooh. If you're not watching right now and you would like to answer that question for Charm City Bricks, just comment below. And well done for watching an hour of this after we've been on air. <laughs> oh, gosh. You've been out this for an hour and you haven't even finished building one lion. Uh, you won't let me build one. It's not fair. Ooh. Making noises. <laughs> I must return to my lair. And you're the hope of Galador, Nicholas. <laughs> They're trying to talk to each other. This is more fun than destroying realms. <laughs> They're talking to each other. It's like watching two furbies talk to each other. <laughs> this is fascinating. Fascinating. Upper legs oh, on. wow, printed parts. Yeah. Nice. About the only printed tiles in the thing. Printed parts in the whole. Are they the uh, two by two round plates? Yeah. yeah. Nice. They look almost like a. Um, I'm trying to think of. Uh, they did mention something mechanically. They wanted them to look similar to like a. Some sort of handle. Uh, with the screws around it, you could use it as like a hubcap or with um, on the top of an engine. And I want it to be just vague enough. Just vague enough to give it that sense of what it's supposed to be. Oh, good. It's probably enough to give it enough uses that they can use it in other. Hmm. Hey, hey, Amy. Amy's joining us in the live chat. Hey, hey. Are you building anything, Amy? Or are you just come to watch? It's all good. We've been having fun with um with uh, Bailey unboxing some <laughs> Calador stuff. And he was making them talk to each other just before. But he's trying to figure things out, so he's mute at the moment. Ah, Amy's saying, love the t-shirts, Bailey and ABC. Yeah, I got Doctor Who. This is just from Kmart. Yeah. Like, Kmart has some cool shirts. And Bailey has, what, faster moods, why sook when you can berate. <laughs> nice. I designed it myself. I got bored and I love barbecue sauce, so I thought I'll do the Master Foods parody. Thank you, Amy. <laughs> I'm glad you noticed it. I noticed it. <laughs> like, that's a cool shirt. I was like, that's a cool shirt, but like I verbalized it inside of my brain instead of actually saying it outside yeah. of my brain. Not many people know what it is. So they talk to each other? Uh, they sort of. <laughs> They're trying to. Hey, JD Brickhead. If you're yeah. up a bit late. <laughs> on a school night <sighs> not building just finishing having dinner oh that's all good <laughs> my brother says I just come to heck on my older sister yeah it's only because I won't let you be on here Bernie <laughs> could heck on me in person and serve in the live chat ow ow I'm under a table no, I know how the, I'm under Tatooine. Now I know how the Sarlacc feels. Oh, God. 
Oh my god, Darkseid, there's a mission on this figure that can help with your swooshing ability. Oh, is there? It, you can test fly the suit, and if you shake it too much, it crashes. So you've got to swoosh it around just... Uh, yeah. just, the right, just the right amount. <laughs> so you've got a robot that's got swoosh ability. That's a robot that teaches, teaches kids. <laughs> How to swoosh. Yeah. That's pretty that, nuts. That should be mandatory. <laughs> <laughs> and Galador didn't do well. Jeez. It does look a bit weird, though. I think it's cool. And I'm not just saying that because I'm friends with Bailey. It, it had some redeeming, value, you know, redeeming qualities. Not many, but it had some. <laughs> As someone who wasn't really into Lego until recently, I guess I have a more open, you know, mind to the concept of other things that aren't the system. Ow. Just photo bomb your live stream at the shows. Ah, note to self: oh, we're going to lock the door. Sorry, what? Well, Adam says he's going to photobomb at the show. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. One lion down. Nice. Oh, Ooh, it was so cool. And it only took a whole hour. <laughs> but the next, yeah, but the next, the oh. next three should be lightning fast now because they're all the same. Uh, uh, no, the two, f the, the next one will be exactly the same as this, but in blue. Mm. And then. Then I do the black line, which is completely different. And then I do... Oh, and the arms will be slightly different. Yeah, the green and the... Yeah, red line. Green and red are the um, arms. And they're pretty much exactly the same. The line has way. a hole in its bum. Yeah, that's where the... I know. That's <laughs> oh, don't do that, actually. <laughs> that's what I was doing. <laughs> but it has a hole in its bum, look! You don't have to point at it with your finger internally, though. <laughs> most, most, most lions do. Not, not like this. Oh, goodness gracious. It's just finger size, too. <coughs> oh, dear. Oh. <laughs> what? Um, how is that cannon thing on its back mounted? Is it just sort of swiveling on some uh, Technic pins or something? Uh, a little bit. Hang on. I'll show you. It's got a like, Technic axle, hasn't it? It's actually sort of, um, oh, hang on. Um, it is two round by round, one by two by two by one that have the Technic. Oh, okay. And there's three of them. So you got one there, one there, and one there, and then the two of the black Technic pins holding them together. Oh, okay, cool. So it swivels it. It doesn't swivel a lot because of the way it. Yeah, just enough for that fit. Yeah, just to get That's that. Pretty. Okay. Oh, get out of it, Sergey. Go. Uh, hello, Douglas McBrickin. It's about time you turned up. Lego had a webcam before they were a thing. Mm-hmm. Hey, what? A vision command to let your robot see. They go for an absolute mozza on Bricklink. Oh, my goodness. The ones that actually work. I can't believe that's still in the box. He's still got his registration form in here too. Oh wow! Yeah, I remember all the the, the stuff from the nine. He's having all the advertisings for all the other. Lego came with a warranty. Wow! Because <laughs> it had to with that stuff. Yeah, look at the books. My God, he's got all three books are in here, and they're in Mickey Mouse mint condition. As he drops it into a drink. No, no way in hell. Can you imagine if, like, just normal sets had warranties as well? Like, if your part is missing. See, now, that's a part list that should come with every set. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's impressive. That's pretty flash. Mm -hmm. that, like, now I know how Mel managed to work out what was missing. Is that, like, one-to-one -one scale? It's pretty damn close, isn't it? It can't be. Hang on, I'll soon tell you. Nice. What was that bit I had in my hand before? No, it's not. Not one, one to one. Not quite. 
No. Oh, well, never mind. It looked exciting for a second there, and then I was like, disappointed. I remember when he first got this and we set it all up, and it, he had it set up so it um, protect his bedroom. <laughs> so when anyone walked through the door in his room, this thing would chase you out the room. Oh, cool. Literally, it would walk, it'd walk towards you, and you, if you didn't walk away, it would just walk straight into your shin. <laughs> And it'd be, yeah, it had the flashing pew, 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 all that sort of shit going on. It was a top little set. Oh, remember when Declan used to use uh, the portal turret oh, thing? Oh, yeah. The plushy. <laughs> portal plushy. He still has it. Yeah. You turn it on and, like, it had a sensor. So if you walk towards his bedroom door, it would start, like, its little shooting noises. Oh, uh, yeah. I didn't know they made a plushy with that. That's cool. Yeah. Wow. I didn't know that you could make an – see if I can get it on the get the picture on the camera. Where am I? You could make – Different different stuff. Uh, where is it? You could make an AAT tank. Huh. Oh, yes. I've seen someone do that. Yeah. AAT tank. That's like saying ATM machine. Yeah, an AAT. <laughs> Were there um, alternate builds? You know the the Star Wars Technic sets. Um, you know there was like a Jango Fett and a Stormtrooper and C. Oh, the buildable figures. Yeah. Yeah. The early ones. Were there alternate builds for those? I've I honestly there. don't know. I never collected the buildable figures. Oh, that's right. I think I've asked you that. If you had any before, I've got yeah. the um the destroyer droid and a normal battle droid. I'll yep. have a look and see if there are any. Yeah, I never got into the buildable figures. This may be your inlet. <laughs> no. <laughs> they're uh, defunct now. They're not doing them anymore. Hey, did you hear they're not doing brickheads anymore, um, Sheree? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's a touchy subject. They're cancelling the whole brickhead line. Just as someone forces me to buy brickheads, now they're going to cancel them. But Shuri, Shuri bullied me into buying them, and now they're going to cancel. Only the Star Wars ones. I don't care. She still bullied me into buying them. I'm going to say it and say it and keep saying it while she's not here because <laughs> I can get away with it. <laughs> Everyone goes quiet. <laughs> We're just letting Shuri voice her opinion, saying that she can hear you. I know she can hear me. She'll punch me when I'm asleep in three weeks' time. <laughs> ah, giving me ideas. Good. She's saying you're giving her ideas. Yeah, I heard. <laughs> I just didn't know what mode the microphone was set in. If it was more shotgun or ambient. Uh, I'm getting more and more and more of a need to buy castle sets when I see them come up on Facebook. So I can do a castle tabletop. I really know I shouldn't. Because yeah. that's going to get more out of control than Star Wars, I think. Yeah, I think that's a very um, deep yeah. rabbit hole. To... Do you know where you um, Not really. And if I do that, I've got to do trees and uh, uh, trees. Over underneath the stuff. Mm -hmm. How can something that Lego you can make in Lego look so good but be so annoying that you just don't want to build them? Exhibit A. Trees. <clears throat> Is it because it's too... Lego trees look awesome. I love the Lego trees we did for Mel's Dagobah um, mock yeah. um, little scene, but you can't move it. If you touch it, Leaves fall off everywhere. It's like, ah, yeah. oh, we had the same problem when we got all the trees. Oh, Cherie's dinosaur table must just give you a nightmare every time you got to go oh, to yeah. a show. It used to be a lot worse. Mm. Oh, dear. Um, yeah, Lego trees, I can actually understand cradling if you're never going to pull them apart just to save the headaches. But I could never do that. I think I may have stripped the. Oh, okay. Oh, hang on. I don't think it's actually screwed in. Hopefully. Well, that's stupid. You can't even turn these off. 
they have no off button? No. I thought, I thought the head coming off was the off button. Well, no, it just goes to the default. What head do you want to put on it? Uh. <laughs> you can put on two different heads. It'll be the robot dude or the bad guy. Ah, uh, okay, and the different head triggers the different voices? Yeah, exactly. Ah, uh, uh, there you go. Notice there's a tiny pin inside the Technic pin that holds them on to the model. Yeah. That is at different heights, and I'm imagining the different height pressing down on the button inside where it mounts probably obviously is the, the difference in whatever commands it it's it's mode. But I never even noticed they were there until I saw that they actually had a use. <laughs> learning so much. Yeah, Speaking right. of learning, there's a technique that gives the hips in Voltron the you know, the planting that they need to um, to clear each other. Yeah, he was. Um, Sean was talking about having to do that. Yeah, sounds like a pretty interesting um, set of connections. Like it's a couple of things that all have to work together. Yeah, I'm thinking there's a guy who's done a modification to it to actually make the hips more squarer because they're sort of slant in. I think he's added a couple more parts or something so that actually look bulk out the hips to give yeah. them enough room and give the legs actually more upright instead of that sort of slant in. Yeah. Make it look like just probably to give it a bit more stability too. The knees don't um, don't bend, do they? That was another thing they had to omit just because of the size of it. Yeah, I don't think there's a huge amount of posability with it. I guess in the pose that it's in is sort of at least good enough and enough to resemble the show. Yeah, I think they when Lego designed it, it's more like. Yeah, this is just going to be probably bought by all the adult fans of the show. Because they did uh, the 1980s version to... William, offline. Goodbye. To do that sounds like an off switch. It is. Ah. <laughs> um, Charm City and Douglas are having a conversation saying that Castle returns in 2019. Offline. Goodbye. Surprise me. Oh, I hope it does. Oh, man. I'm going to be so broke. Same. <laughs> the beauty of only doing Star Wars is every six months I don't spend money. Yeah. Because I don't have to worry about all the other new releases and new different things. We can console each other. <laughs> um, <laughs> we a few of them. Uh, I won't need consoling. I'll need burying once my wife hears what I want to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'll write you eulogy then. <laughs> well, I found the Barry box open. That's annoying. <clears throat> I have to do something about that. Yeah. I was hoping to be able to show. They do bring Castle back. I hope they, um, when they bring it back, they don't do a, a good and a bad, like you know, the Witch's Castle, the Vampire's Castle, and the and the Knight's Castle. I hope they do something different because that's what they've done in the past. Mm. It'd be cool to see something different. Oh, nice. And do some different monsters and stuff too. Flashy. Uh -huh. oh, what the hell is that? The turret, the portal turret from Portal. Oh, okay. Yeah. Anyway, I was next, hoping. Next to get question: the, What's Portal? Because the batteries are dead on them. I was hoping to get the battery box open, but some somebody somebody once told me the world is going to roll me. <laughs> somebody screwed it up. And and threaded the screws, the screw heads. We've never actually opened. As far as I know, we've never actually opened the box. It's just the batteries from the store. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Oh, good lord! We got some toys in at Christmas. Uh, the ones that you walk past in the store, and they oh, they make noise. noise because all of the security things have been pulled out. That little tab that stops the batteries oh, from working. Yeah, making the. <laughs> And they're starting to get to the point where a few of them, the ones that came in after Christmas, are starting to warn that their batteries are running out. Oh, no. Oh, wow. We had one the previous year that pipes up every, you know, 30 seconds. Oh, I think it's time to change the battery. <laughs> <laughs> ended up just having to open them and pull the batteries out. Uh, Adam, no. 
don't re-release Nexo Knights. Don't do Space Castle. I want good <laughs> old-fashioned fantasy. <laughs> I want dragons and knights and goblins and trolls yeah, and in that boat. There's a, there'll be a ton of people wanting that. Just some 000. of the different sorts of basic fantasy creatures, monsters. That'd be nice. 2007 fantasy era castle would have to have been the best for creatures and characters. It had the standard knights and whatnot, and all your squires and things. It had sort of captives, a skeleton horde as an enemy, yep. led by an evil wizard that was sort of a counterpart to the good wizard. Then there was the trolls, and there was the dwarves. It was like it had the whole thing. Oh, that's what. That's all I need to do is re-release that. Yeah. They sort of strayed away from that kind of castle with the ones that came after it. it. Probably enough time between. That was 2007. We're coming into yeah. 19. That would be enough time for the different generations to. Well, they've had Lord of the Rings since, so imagine what they could come up with now. Yeah. The problem is Gru won't actually. It come... says open close. Yeah, it's what's called a captive screw, hun. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It's not. The screw will never come out, but it will loosen, but it'll never come out. Yeah, it's only meant to come out a certain amount. Yeah. That Stops little kitties from swallowing them. Yes. and loose. That was what was on these two as well. Well, then how do you open it then, Smarty? Once the screw's loose, loosened right off, it should um, be a slide and pop open <coughs> system. Uh, oh, not a slide and pop open thing. It does say open, close. Otherwise, throw it on a hard surface, the lid will come off. <laughs> How fragile is uh, Voltron shaping up to be? Speaking of, uh, the lines themselves are pretty, pretty, pretty solid. Uh, they don't feel fragile. Like... That's good. Yeah. yeah well, I don't know how he's going to be himself when he's fully assembled. But the lines are very solid. It sounds like the way that the limbs attach are rather strong as well. They got like four mounting points. Yeah. The um. Connect onto Technic axles mm. and use the Technic the opposite side. The Y wing engines were like that. They just joined. They just connected onto the body with um, three Technic axles. But when you get them to the end and the, that final push to get them to join, it's solid as. There's no shaking. There's no vibrating. No no looseness at all. I was quite quite impressed with that. Mm. It was a similar connection with the uh, panels on the uh, TIE Fighter, the UCS TIE Fighter. They would yeah. come on onto an axle and some pins at the end, and then you would click down studs on either direction. Yep. Yeah, I got him. You know when they need to make something strong, just, how to make just it like, decently strong. Just over my shoulder. Ah, yes. Come on. I'll get in here if I have to break that. Good thing Declan's not watching this. I can see a shelf going up in Bailey's room and have Galador all over it. Oh, you've not seen the shelf in the other room then. Ah, okay. <laughs> we already have a Galador shelf, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, I've got... You know those, like, Kallax Ikea shelves, the big sort of storage unit squares? Yeah. I've got a 4 by 4 one of those, and everything in the shelves is just all of my stuff. And then <laughs> the top of it, from end to end, is a boxed and loose version of the same Galador figure, just alternating. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's good. I don't have some of those floating around, actually. Where are they? Uh... Noting that some of the boxes from the dinosaurs, particularly probably the one that has the. Oh no, there might be some in the backpack. Backpack, backpack. backpack. What do you mean, Douglas? Superhero girls will last forever. It was the most popular set ever. The most <laughs> popular theme. Is that why it only lasted one run? Yeah, a whole seven people bought it. What's this? Uh, oh, oi, oi, flash pants. He says, if you're watching Hauling and Bulling, there was a drop test of Voltron. I was surprised it held up pretty good. Yeah, I can see why. Building it, I can see why. It feels 
it's so solid. It doesn't feel flimsy. Ah, there. I broke something, but now at least I can get it out. <laughs> oh. So what's been deleted? Nexo Knights, Brickheads, Microfighters, Superhero Girls, Biddable Figures. What are the other two? Microfighters? Yeah, they, they're they cancelling the Microfighters as well. Oh, I like those. So it's a good way to get some good Star Wars minifigures. Hmm. Corroded batteries. There was two other things that were being cancelled too, apparently. Okay. I think there was going to be a re-release of Galador. <laughs> yeah, that would be so popular right now. You've got to be careful, Bailey, because anything you say, people just are going to take it as gospel. You realise that, don't you? Especially after your overseas trip. You come back and say anything, people are just going to believe you. <laughs> Somebody asks me about something, no matter what I say, whether it's true or not, I'll just give them a wink. <laughs> Head headlines, front page news. <laughs> Yeah, well, we got Lego Races two coming out. Lego <laughs> Races three and two remaster. That's one thing that I would like to come out. Another races game. Come on, TT, you can do it. <laughs> Flash Pants is hoping the other two is Uni Kitty and Adventure Time getting cancelled. <laughs> There's only ever one Adventure Time set anyway. Uni Kitty and Minecraft. No. <laughs> no Minecraft won't. It's <laughs> way too popular. It's just, it's made for Lego, isn't it? Oh, yeah, well and truly. Uni Kitty and Friends. There you go. Cancel those as well. Friends? Oh, I won't be going to Friends. So, second top selling line. Yeah. Marvel's. Wow. Yes, the Master Builder series, which is basically Hoth, Endor, and the New Cloud City, and some people are arguing that the Death Star should be part of that as well. Actually, Endor's not part of it because it was done properly, apparently. <laughs> it's just people's what people's thoughts are. That's the thing. The Cloud City will be a Master Builder set. They've said that, but they've said nothing about moving... Hoth, Endor, and Death Star to Master Builder line. Nothing official has been said. It's alive. Oh, is, that, is that yours making that noise? Yep. I thought Bailey had triggered another Gelador thing. No, that's the turret. That is turret. Oh, that one. Okay. Yeah, okay. That's a minute, but... Bill's and um, <laughs> Flash Pants said they won't get rid of Minecraft because that's the only way they can get any use out of their two by bricks. <laughs> very loud though. <laughs> Go and sneak it up into Declan's room. <laughs> so, what does it do? It's got a center in the front of it. Oh, it okay. Just targets and it shoots at them. So the red light at the front is a sensor yeah it does say other things too but um yeah i didn't want to have too much of of triggering um sounds that might get me demonetized uh. it's cute but deadly okay so i didn't get answered last time i asked i'll ask again what the hell's portal it's a uh, game First-person puzzle game. Okay. You're essentially, you have held a, a gun that can shoot uh, like an A and a B portal, one you go into and the other you pop out of. It's um, fairly interesting physics for a game. It takes a bit to get used to it, but um, it's a pretty awesome um, experience. Your velocity and whatnot comes through the portal with you, so you can sort of... Say you're up on a big ledge, you can put a portal on the wall behind you, a portal down at the bottom uh, of this big, you know, cliff, and then if you jump into the portal down, it'll, you know, <laughs> shoot you over a gap. Okay. And that's how you solve the puzzles. There's other little sort of accessory 
things for the puzzles, but a lot of it is just sort of moving yeah. through this big uh, sort of test facility. Yeah, and you're essentially a test subject. Yes. Oh, Karen. Yeah, and the person that runs the place absolutely hates you. Yeah, and the cake is a lie. <laughs> There's a reward of cake at the end, but it's a it's lie. It's a lie. There is no reward. Spoilers. If no one's played Portal One, by now. By now. Tough. That's on them. Their fault. Hell, I've never played the game. <clears throat> I've never part. heard of it until just now. Like, so. Yeah, not, not a lot. Bit. Gosh, we had Portal when we used to live in Kimpy, didn't we? Yeah, something like that. That about, was a long time ago. First part of the blue line. Yep, keep building, hurry up. Yeah, well, they do seem, seem to come together a lot. The second line, this does mm. seem to come together a lot faster than the first one. Oof, oof. Yes, I'm well aware that you have work in the morning. That's okay. Um, there's nothing stopping me from leaving. You know where the stop button is. Mm. The poor, the poor cat will get ignored. Oh well, I'm sure they'll forgive you. As long as you keep building things. Yeah, well, I'm already on to bag five. Keep going. Yeah, I am. Hurry up. Only I'm bag five. five. Yeah. How long have we been going now? An hour and a half. Jeez, only bag five. <laughs> You're slowing down, dude. He's got to savour it. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of parts. It's like a 2,000 piece set. Lots of parts. Parts are put together. Lots of parts. Have you come across the uh, spare part that I was after? No. Must be. Must be in like the black one. American. Yeah, I would think so. It'll be in bag 16. <laughs> well, Ellie's like, I'm watching for the part. It's all right, I've still got like three and a half weeks. It's plenty of time. <laughs> it could be actually in the, the sword or the shield, too. It's like, um, oh, possible. I trust the Shadali post so much that, um, yeah, I would want to like drive that and put it in your hand. At least you're able to source your special part. Yeah. You missed the 10 bananas. Yeah, try getting your hands on a tan banana in Australia. What What are you wanting to use tan bananas for? Is this... For the tusks for the menthol. Do they have to be tan bananas? Well, it'd look funny with yellow tusks. They've got to be sort of bone coloured. Yeah, bone colour. Oh. for the tans for. But they only came in one set. Yeah, um, I think it's that one that's sitting over there. Harry and the hormonal humongous or right, something right, it's called. That was gold right. bananas. I'm pretty sure that was tan in that one. No, the set that they come in is Harry and the Hormonal hormonal Humongous or some stupid <laughs> the, hung, um, hungering hippo or something. It sounds like a no, bad the, adult the movie. Hungarian Horntail. That's the one. Harry and the Hungarian Horntail. Sounds like a really bad <laughs> adult movie. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, that's the only set that a tan banana can be found in. And guess what? There's two of them in there. So yep. I need to get two of those sets. I feel your pain. And the other annoying thing that I'm up, that I'm trying to track down, but I'm giving up on, unless I accidentally come across one, is um the um the top half of a um, blimp balloon. Oh, from the adventurous stuff. Yeah, you know the the round. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck. One half of that makes a perfect Tuscan Raider tent. Oh yes. Yeah. It like seems like Tuscan Raider. seems like a waste of the part uh, to use that. Would you be able to use the other end for something? God knows. <laughs> it depends on how much different how different it is, the other end is. It could probably be used as another style of tent. Well, I suppose <laughs> if you imagine a blimp, it's pretty much the same as the front, a little more conical with fins on the top of it. Yeah, you'd think they'd be almost the same. Some sort of silo or something in your city. Hang on. Oh, yeah, that could that could work too. Um, hang on for a second. Where's my want list? 
because for how expensive it'll be, it may be worth getting. Oh, you can't even get one in Australia. Yeah, it may be worth getting the whole thing rather than just the half of it. It comes in six sets, but because I want a tan one, <laughs> oh, no. they come in two sets. Far Pharaoh's Forbidden Ruins and Aero Nomad. A 1998 set and a 2003 set. No. Tough, tough. Uh, actually, they're the, the 2003 set's the newest one because the other sets are 1997, 1998, 1995, and 2000 for the different colours. So, yeah, the Aero Nomad. Uh, let's have a look. Open the set up. <laughs> set 7415. 111 parts, oh, just for humor factor. Uh, the last six months is the most current price. Oh, $35 for the set used. Se 71 new. Yeah. And the parts, let's see, what's the bottom half look like? I just had that same tune go through my head. <laughs> really? Yeah. <gasps> Uh, the bottom part of it is 2618, part number. Uh, give me a better picture of it. Uh, it looks like it could be used. You just have to put, by the looks of it, um, four one by 4 bricks in to replace the parts that are missing and just turn it on its side, on, on its bottom. So, yeah, it could be used. Mm. But, hey, that means I've got to find this set for sale in Australia somewhere. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, 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 ha. Uh, In Australia, search. Nothing. Nope, no. Nothing. Fine. Anywhere. Nope, no. What? Anywhere, nothing. What? 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 Nope, no. Oh, there you go. Uh, I could get it from Germany for thirty-seven dollars, Australian, and another thirty-something dollars for postage, probably. Ha ha ha! Ha ha! And I don't buy outside the Australia anyway. What? Not even Germany. No, I don't buy nothing from nowhere. If I don't buy from Australia, I don't own it. That's why you can't find um, any of these in Australia on Bricklink at the moment. Ah, oh, it's all your fault. All these domes. I've got all ten of them that were in the country in, on Bricklink. <laughs> Why don't you go overseas? <laughs> because I'm too impatient and I don't trust people. Trust? Trusting strangers on the internet? The amount of horror stories I hear about Lego stuffing up orders is bad enough. I don't need to go overseas to up to actual people. That's because you're only hearing the bad stories. Nobody ever says, oh, I had a great experience with... The yeah, I know, yeah, time. yeah. Yeah, no, people don't post the good stuff very often, do they? The thing came up today about uh, missing parts, and I thought you, you don't hear anyone say, my, my set came with all of the parts. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's the expectation. Yep. It's like, yes, my, my set came with all the parts and spares. This... Uh, this set that I got here, the only reason that I bought it, I've actually got another one of it. The only reason that I got it was because the first one was missing the seat and this guy's staff, and it was cheaper to buy this whole thing plus postage than buying just yeah. that seat and that staff and getting them shipped individually. That's sad. Worked out all right in the end because mm. then I don't need to open the boxed one. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, uh, Amy is saying price is fairly reasonable as long as it's not from the USA or the UK. Yeah. I do concur with that. The only... Um, you do you have to worry about some parts of the Czech Republic too? Yeah. Depends on what part of the Czech Republic because of the way that their postal service is billed. Yeah, it's um, quite bizarre. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Like, er, like, if it goes from, like, one <laughs> distribution centre to another... You get one charge for that and then another charge for it to go in to close to the border and then over the border and then whatever else. Mm. Yeah. 
So it can be deceptive. You can think, oh, yeah, that's going to be cheap, and then you get a slug with all these extra charges. But, yeah, you just got to um, know where your sellers are. Go with the ones that other people buy from. Yeah. I bought a, a sort of bunch of parts from a store in Turkey in July 2016 was when the that was when the coup was happening. Um, and it took like three months or something for it to get to me because it was just stuck at the border for Yonks because they weren't doing anything for a while. That sucks. At least you got it. Yeah. Could have been worse. The seller even messaged me and said, yeah, well, we got curfew. So it's going to be a while until I get to the get to the post office. It's like, oh, okay, you, you do you. Don't worry. Cuff yourself. Don't get shot. Yeah. <laughs> the only exactly the same time. Yeah. The only country I've had consistent issues with on Bricklink is Italy. Oh, really? I rarely have an issue with anywhere else, but it seems just about every time I buy from Italy, I don't anymore. Um, you know, I'll have new parts. They're marked as new, but they've got, like, texture, you know, written all over them and chew marks and... I think I ordered something from Belgium that took up at an age to come, but it arrived. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. It's it's just consistently been either completely false uh, marking of, you know, the condition of the parts or packed mm -hmm. horribly or it's odd. I've, uh, after the, I think, the fifth purchase or something, I just said, no, nah, I'll just... Yeah, we usually oh, try and stick to out of that. Yeah, we, we try to stick to, to, like, Germany or Poland or mm. somewhere in that general vicinity seems to be pretty reliable. And they seem to be a lot better on parts prices too. Yeah, yeah. it's the vicinity to the factory. Yeah. The um, Netherlands has some great stuff, but it's so damn expensive with postage from the... Their postage is shocking. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> my favourite was the one where uh, somebody had put my Bricklink order inside of an empty Lego box without turning it inside out. And posted it like that. Like, it was just the Lego box with, like, the label on, with my address on the outside. <laughs> and wow. I'm like, going, how that didn't get stolen, I do yeah. not know. It's like advertising, hey, I'm Lego, steal me. Oh, don't you love some of the boxes that things get sent in, though? It's like just a window into the life of the seller. Yeah. Like a hair straightener box in one and I had a <laughs> cereal box in another. And Yeah, I've had some other interesting boxes, but usually people turn them inside out. Yeah. So that it's not like the cereal box or whatever on the outside. It's like, oh, I didn't order uh, wheat bran. <laughs> uh, yeah, somebody's trying to tell you something, Bailey. <laughs> Oh, we've got brother from another brick has dropped in and say hey, hello. I in a while. Oh, he drops in from time to time. Jesus, I'm not buying that from the UK. UK is expensive postage. We just yeah. had this conversation. Yeah, just your conversion rates ridiculous. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Just double, well, double. In it. the entire of the world, there's one place where I can buy a Jewback. <laughs> and that's from someone in Denmark. Someone in Denmark? Who? Bailey goes, I'm going to Denmark. <laughs> yeah, if you manage to bump into this person. <laughs> oh, dear. Could you try eBay? Like international eBay? Every now and then there'll be ones that uh, the seller doesn't quite know what they've got and so you can get a decent deal. Yeah, yeah. I uh, haven't spent much time on eBay of late because it's such a, a joke now. Mm. Yeah. Dave has some Jewbacks. Dave who? Who said what? Just Tom Dave. says Dave has some Jewbacks. Oh, yeah, that's helpful. Dave, Dave who? Dave who? <laughs> Just Dave. Just Dave. Have oh, it? Dave. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what? Dave, you're up. <laughs> oh, oh, you all know Dave. Who the is Dave. <laughs> He's Dave with the Jewbacks. 
Just give it back Dave. Give it back Dave. That's all it is. <laughs> uh, sorry, Charm. I don't mean to slag on you. <laughs> oh, you're saying Obi Wan. Well, then why didn't you say Obi Wan? Haven't seen Dave. I, I, I had a feeling that's who you were talking about. But I was like, yeah, is it is it that Dave or is it another Dave? Well, that doesn't help me either. So. Yeah, he lives on the Gold Coast. Um, Flash is asking, what do I want? I'm after the top half of a balloon. That should confuse him. Top <laughs> half of a balloon from Adventurers. I can even tell you the part number, dude, because that will make more sense then. Now onto the leg, making the legs of the blue lion. Okay. Brick, link, brick link part number 2598. Building one or two would be even awesome, more awesome, or even just the whole balloon top and bottom because I could use both halves. But 2598 is the top, I think the other one's 2597, something like that. We might go together pretty quickly. Uh, your brother-in-law is trolling you again, saying, are we done yet? Are we done yet? Are we done yet? Are Don't we just put him on time out. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like the Transformers transformation <laughs> sound. Why is it always needing hard-to-find or expensive parts? We've got expensive yeah, tastes. Special. Huh. My brother says it looks like I need to go to bed. Yeah, I should have had a nap. But that can be counterproductive. I have to be up early in the morning for work. You can't be counterproductive if you're not actually being productive to start with, seeing how hubby won't let you do anything. Yeah, it's all his fault. Yeah. I, I didn't say that. Hey, don't go putting words in my mouth. Hey, I didn't say they were your words. They were very clearly my words. <laughs> Look at all the pieces he's still got left to go with that line. But these are the legs, and then the second line's done. Yeah, two out of five. Yeah. So that's why it's a seven-hour build. It's an hour per line. But that, you, you, that doesn't math right. Isn't there seven lines? There's five. There's five, five lines. Yeah, but and then you got the head. Or is that the head of the black line? The black line makes the head. It's a... <laughs> The whole torso, the head. Oh. Oh. And there's something new. <laughs> so what part does the black lion's tail make? Well, Charles Sidwick says there are some geobacks <laughs> for sale in New Zealand. <laughs> New Zealand? New Zealand. New Zealand. New Zealand's a good idea, actually. New Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. New Zealand's a good that. idea. Well, money's actually worth something over there. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, what, are we, but, but. what are we worth? A dollar thirty-five or something? Huh. Timmy says, "Oi, I just landed back in Hong, Hong Kong. Have lots of Lego. Good for you." Where was he? Oh, China. That's right. No, he went to Malaysia to Lego Land. I'm assuming it was Malaysia. He's I think Zolland. that's what he says. Malaysia Lego Land. No, there's nothing in New Zealand. No. Three of them new for sixteen dollars and one cent. I'm not getting them. They're not coming up on mine. That might be because. Because. Special. No, I just. Diggler says. I've got conditions set to any. New Zealand. Maybe I've got to pick new specifically. Let's see. Are they sets or just the dewbacks? No, they're not coming up. One, two, three, Christ, New Zealand, twenty-four, twenty-four. Bricks, brick, NZ. Ah, oh, they might not sell to um, Australian stores. Well, that sucks. Yeah, they might not ship. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. Maybe if you try contacting them. Because I've got stores that do not ship to me is ticked, so I, they don't waste my time when they come up on the list. Maybe you could send him a message saying, dude, 
Actually, even when I take that off, it still doesn't bring them up. There needs to be a, a word or some words to describe, like, putting on puppy dog eyes, but for typing. <laughs> you know, just adding that slight bit of schmooze, you know, sob story, and you help a, help a brother out. Help a brother out. Yeah, I wonder why that's we'll coming up. a lot. If I take off the stores that do not ship to me, if I untick that, they should come up on my list and they're not coming up. Oh, so they must only they must only deal with New Zealanders. Yeah, Charm City Brick can find the store, so does that work? I don't know what's going on there then. Charm City's in the States, isn't it? Mm. America land. Well, if they ship to America land, you'd think they'd ship to Australia land. Yeah, we're just across the pond. Just to make sure we're talking the same model of view back, it's 16875 PB01. Yep, that's the one. PB01 CO1. Oh, CO1. I've only got the O1. What's the CO1? Is that the, does that have the whole kit, the saddle and everything? That's the, um, that's the variant that is only sold in New Zealand that uh, <laughs> they don't want Darkseid to buy. Yeah, <laughs> that, that's the one. That's probably not coming up because you're not looking for that specific version. No, I'm not. I'm looking for 16875 PBR. Uh, City Rick says complete assembly. Ah, uh, there you go. See, I was only after the Dubak because I've got everything else. Ah, uh, but when you... PB01 CO1. CO1. Boom. Um... What do you mean, Voltron? Johnny G says. I haven't finished Ninjago City yet. That's okay. You can keep building. Yeah. At least you're allowed to build. Uh, that's the old style, Dubac, not the new one. Does it matter? Yes, it matters. Does it matter? Well, then if you have the old style matter? one and I've got two new ones, it'll look like it's the special member of the family. What's the difference? The old one's different in what way it's stumpier shorter um not invited to the family gatherings yeah <laughs> not locked by everyone else oh dear and now i'm pretty sure the old one doesn't have there is something what is it what's different about the old one it doesn't have the opening mouth or something i can't remember Says it was released in 2014. Tell me that oh, up. Got Tie Fighter arm. Ow. Did a newer one come out that I missed? No, 2014 was when the last Cantina set came out. <gasps> See, I've got I've got the number from the Cantina set, so that's the number for the actual. Johnny G said, hey, ABC, break down Ninjago City and build it at that with me. <laughs> no. Well, it still, tick it still tickles my funny bone that the there is a Bailey in Ninjago City with a Galador shirt, no less. Oh. Yep. With his hair Have tied back. Completed blue lion. Yay. Oh. You should show it to the overhead cam where people can see it in better detail, hopefully. Hopefully. Nice. There are some subtle differences, mm. but it's, it's basically worked out. There's the whole what the legs of the black line are going to slip down into. At least it didn't give the blue one a prostate exam. <laughs> How the black line will give us a prostate exam. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> A permanent one. Yeah, can you stand on your head for a minute? <laughs> Whack. Whack. <laughs> let me just put let me just put the black lines stump yeah. into the back of this one's quite bags alone. Oh dear. Dear, dear, uh, dear, dear, dear. The Voltron kitties are huge. Yeah, yeah they are pretty big. Right out now. Let's have a look at that, this. That, that's the size of my hand. There's the kitty. Oh, we dropped him. 
Exactly. Oh, with eyes and nostrils and leg spots. It has a hole. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. At him! Tippity tap 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 tap. Well, this is the biggest book too. We'll get on with it. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I gotta get a different keyboard. Less, uh, less chappy. Tappy keyboards are cool. Well, they are when, like, you're on your own and you're feeling powerful writing something. You can just. <laughs> <laughs> when you're telling your client. Well, not so well, that's weird. The CO1 um, due back, I can only see one in Hungary or well, two in Hungary for sale. Can't see anything to do with New Zealand. So I don't know why they're not turning up. No Zealand. I'm assuming you got That's a mechanical a keyboard, Bailey. Hmm? Yeah. Cherry MX red switches. Yeah, that one's got um, blues, box. so they're extra clicky. Oh, uh, yeah. I've got, um, on mine, I've got um, silence. The silent ones. Which are just quite just clicky, but quite clicky. I might try them. I, I like the the feedback, not just physically, but audibly, sort of knowing that you've done something. <laughs> Tippity tap 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 to tap. I think well, all that are... aside, did flesh pans ever get back to me about that balloon part? God, how much have I got to scroll back through now? Yeah, there are 67 new G-backs for sale from the 2014 Cantina set. Yeah, where? Ah. Uh, Belly says, hey, Tim, any exclusives with your new Lego? Apparently, Brick NZ's the store. Search store name. Everywhere. Lick NZ. That was more African than New Zealand. Lick NZ. No, I couldn't find the part, Philip. Okay, cool beans. Thank you for looking. It might be one of those parts that I'll just never come across. Have they ever made a tan croissant? Tan croissant. I have no idea. That might be at least a um, uh, uh, something else you could use. It's reasonably close shape. Oh, to a tan banana? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, we were all talking about the balloon thing, and you said croissant, and I'm thinking, what? <laughs> That's not going to be a, a substitute for the balloon thing for a tent. <laughs> the battery must have been charged. There's also a few different sized uh, animal claws uh, used as like horns and things, maybe worth. Yeah, I was thinking of maybe a, um, a large claw, horn claw thing. Yeah, whichever one they use as the bulls. Um, but I've come up with the other idea of, um, the, like Phil said to me, um, he showed me the picture of the Baron, Baron Sat um, Banther, mm -hmm. and he's made the horn, his horns just out of um, the modified bricks, sloped bricks with um, plate. Oh. And they look just as good. And the rest of the Banther looks almost identical anyway. Hmm. So I've got, I'm getting enough parts off Phil to be able to do those um, tusks instead. Always other possibilities, which is good. Yeah, don't you love Lego? It's just awesome. Sometimes it's good to challenge yourself to find a different part than what you planned on. Oh, I've had to do that a lot over the lifespan of this table. Okay, okay I found the um, New Brick New Zealand store. New Zealand. New Zealand. Now I've just got to have a look at this. toys that's being hidden away. I don't know why that wasn't coming up, though, when I was doing a part search. That's annoying. Yeah, it's a bit odd. 
<laughs> Diglas said the name Jaga Green Dragon has gold bananas. Pimp the Bantha. <laughs> put, some, put some chains on it and everything. <laughs> it, was, it was like Pimp My Ride, but for Star Wars. Yeah, Pimp My Bantha. Exhibit comes in in like a Jedi cloak. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, international orders are shipped via New Zealand Post International Airmail by default and has a delivery target of three to ten working days. That's all right, I can live with it. Offers insurance. Is the amount? Tusk oh, that's not gonna happen. Like elephant tusk. Pricing can be calculated on this website. Any customs or import taxes or duties that may be required by the country or buyer. Blah blah blah. Uh, I don't have to pay import taxes on under anything under a thousand dollars, do I? Or have they changed that? I know that was being talked about being changed at one point. Um, I think it only uh, references uh, retailers, not uh, individual sellers. Oh, okay. So unless that person is a business, um, I'm pretty sure that 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 ruling was more aimed at larger retailers overseas. Cool. Would you imagine them sitting there and like picking through every single parcel and checking it, and going, "Yeah, uh, we're going to ping this one and this yeah. one and this one." It would slow everything down. That's crazy. Now all I need is for this place to have that other part that I'm after. Get them both in the same place. <laughs> Flashman says, "Pimp it with a VW badge around its neck on a chain, lower it, and then." <laughs> <put leather. laughs> Give it, high, give it hydraulic legs so it goes like this. I love it, Dancer. I love it. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> My brother and his friend used to try and lower anything that had wheels that they could get their hands on. I remember he lowered a shopping trolley <laughs> <laughs> and lowered a skateboard. Okay. I didn't Pretty think it would get truck. much lower. Pretty much had the trucks going through the deck itself. So yeah. the board was like less than a centimeter off the ground. Wow. Oh, God. It was good. I, li I like the idea of a lowered bantha. Just cut out its ankles. You're all good. <laughs> so yeah. I want to do that now to like every vehicle and character that I've got. Like, in Lego. I just want <laughs> to break it down a bit. Hip, hip my everything. Have you seen the YouTube channel? I don't know if it's sacrilege to talk about other channels while on another stream. There's a guy that builds stuff to like his kids' suggestions. Mm -hmm. uh, he rebuilds retail sets, um, but makes them cooler and a bit more interesting and whatnot based on what his kid recommends that he should. Mm -hmm. I think that there should be a counterpart channel to his where it's just pimping any Lego vehicle, giving different color schemes, adding decals, really? a massive photo on the back of it. If you don't do it yourself, then you need to encourage somebody else to do it and no, it won't be me. It's a lucrative market. I, I'm, not, I'm, not, people there. I'm not talented enough in vehicles building. <laughs> Pimp my brick. Uh, somebody will watch this and they'll steal the idea now. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. already gone. Channel's made. <laughs> <laughs> Within three seconds. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, uh, my brother Adam's watching and, like, he needs new contact. Adam, you can do it. Yep. Yes. You can on, your, on your next show, you can talk about the new website that opened up called Pimp My Brick. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if you did a Google search and it actually existed? No, I was suggesting that he could do Pimp My Brick as, like, his new show. I could see your brother as a brick pimper. Brick pimping. Yeah, I had to think about that as I said it then. Stay back inside the brick box. <laughs> inside the pimp box? What? Oh. <laughs> oh, no, that's bad. <laughs> oh, my God. That was all sorts of wrong, Philip. All sorts of wrong. It must be close to midnight. No, it's nowhere near midnight. No, I'm sure midnight, it is somewhere in the world. <laughs> Inside the pimp brick. Yeah. I 
should just lie down and have a nap. He's gonna be a while. I'm going as fast as I can. I'm doing it as fast as I can. What are you up to now? You've done both the legs, or at least the working the, the, the black line. Okay, building the black line so far. You're not that far then. I'm about halfway through the bags now. Yeah. Just chill, guys. Uh, it's just the part where I've got to be up at five in the morning. Get a Baraka in you. You'll be good. I might just have a nap behind him and and come back when everyone's ready to finish. Yeah, there's the yeah, there's the couch back there. Just there's a whole couch behind me here. Just, just do that as, as long as you don't snore, it won't be embarrassing or anything. <laughs> So now we know why she's staying awake. <laughs> Would you guys ever be savvy to like a 24 hour live stream where we tag team, we get a couple of builders over to your place and we tag team doing content through the, through the hours. Yeah. I'd probably have to tidy up my house first. <laughs> Make sure that there's enough room for like three more people. Take a week off work so you can actually organise around it. <laughs> no, Timmy, my 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 keyboard is too far away, and I'm not getting up to reach over and get it. I'm too lazy for that shit. I don't know why I can't stop myself from yawning. I think I might call it. Like, I've already had my fun. Time of Bailey. 9.44. Mm, it's not too big. That's I'm, okay. I'm such an old fart. I've got to go to bed early. Old fart. Um, Sean, I don't know if there's any micro machines that you don't have. Um, micro machines. Micro fighters you don't have, but there's someone selling a whole gob load of them oh, on God. Facebook. Deals. That's a I started collecting them when they first started coming out because I'm like, yeah, I'm never going to buy all the UCS sets, so mm. yeah, I'm the closest that I'll get. <laughs> it's one extreme to the other. I'll yeah. never get the UCS Superstar Destroyer, so I'll just buy the micro... All the little things. $15 yeah. for a Superstar Destroyer. I can live with that. Hell yeah. Uh. <laughs> That's funny. On my screen on Facebook, I've got an ad for Brains Trust. Who's that? Oh, that's Phil Kemp. That's his actual thing, yeah. his um, avatar. But it's got brain, um, yeah, something for the uh, brain shouldn't bleed. And then right next to that is a picture of um, Jody. Uh -huh. Bills as misses. <laughs> okay. I just thought that was funny that those two pictures are together. And then that's followed by this Bailey Fulton guy. We've got a question. What sort of hey, stuff does like a 24 hour stream require? <laughs> What was that? What sort of snacks would a 24 hour stream require? Yeah. Copious amounts of iced coffee. Those those uh, hard Mars candy bricks that you can get in like the kilo bags. <laughs> Mars, kilo. Mars bars. Kilo bag of Mars bars at least. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like lots of shopping at Costco. Mm. Chippies. You'd have to have quite a few different flavors of potato chippies and some dip. You probably also have to have real food in that as well. No. Keep it going. You stuff your face before the stream starts. 24 hours seems a long time. 24 hours is a long that's time. What tag, that's why you tag team. I did, I did an eight-hour stream, a build stream, and built most of Destiny's bounty. Did its innards back to front. Had to undo it all. Handed it over to him. My nephews and I used to do 24-hour Dungeons & Dragons sessions. We'd, cool. we'd start on Friday night and finish on Sunday. Yeah. That's awesome. I've done overnighters before. Somehow Saturday got skipped. We just kept playing. But, yeah, we always aimed for 24-hour runs yeah. and went a little bit over. And I was young. Yeah, I was a whippersnapper back then. I was in my 20s. That, I remember that, doing um, movie marathons, proper movie marathons, not these two or three. Oh, yeah. I can't do movie marathons. Next year for my birthday, you guys are invited. Uh, because my birthday is around the time that the uh, the May release, uh, Star, not Star Wars, the May release Marvel movies come out, 
Oh. That will be around the time of Avengers 4, as it was for 3 uh, and Civil War and a bunch of others behind it. So mm -hmm. next year I'm having a marathon of all of the Marvel movies. Ooh. Oh, God. That'll be fun. I set up the Facebook page for it like four years ago. <laughs> it was first sort of talked about that there was going to be this big sort of finale. <laughs> we'll see if it's still up somewhere. Yay. Well, the finale of um, Phase 3. Yeah. I don't know what's going to happen after that. Mm. Oh, all right, I'm out. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us, Bailey. It's been fun. Yeah. Yes, no, I, I enjoyed it. Thank you for having me. Don't it's not a surprise seeing you there when I when I signed up. Yeah, <laughs> I'm right here, and I had all my clothes on this time. Which is good. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Bill's just started. Hey, Bill's just started the stream the other night without pants on. So <laughs> we're actually seeing you on camera, which is a, a, a nice change. Yeah, well, in the new room, I've actually got Wi-Fi. I'm oh in the first century. So I've got my laptop here and my PC here. That's It'll do for now. Excellent. <laughs> okay. Excellent. Goodbye, everybody. Good luck on the build. Uh, you. Hopefully, you can find that spare part. If not, don't worry. They're on BrickLink by now, so I'll just buy one if I need to. Nah, we'll find it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It's coming. The, the number of bags I've got to look through now is um, reducing. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> whittling, whittling down the pile. All right. Thanks for dropping me. See ya. Bye. Yeah, when James said he wasn't going to come, I was like, hey, Bailey. <laughs> I don't usually like to impose. But, uh, yes. Nice to have friends and Obi Wan Kabaili, you're my only joke, my only hope. Obi <laughs> 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 Well, actually, fun fact: Bailey was actually on my very first TGI Friday. Cool. Mm. Yeah, it was a fun one too. Here you are, right, way back in the beginning, I had barely any people watching, but hey, <laughs> probably yeah. why I agreed to do it. I was like, nobody's going to be watching this. So, yeah, why not? I was like, yeah, so if you want to see more of Bailey's, <laughs> you just need to work your way through the playlist and find the ones where he's in it. <laughs> click, click, click. <laughs> Pimped Panthers, definitely, yes. Dark side pre PC. I don't think so. Oh, thank goodness the hint was on. I was using computers before you were even a glint in your mother's eye. Ha, 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 ha. I would have been, actually. How old's your brother? What's this? I had high hopes for you. You undersell yourself. Who's that? Who was that aimed at? I have no idea. Oh, this was aimed at me. <laughs> <laughs> Might have been. I don't know. Might have been. Yeah, maybe. I uh, I uh, I try to be modest and and. Oh yes, about your original stream, probably. Yeah. Oh, it's it's been a fun journey. Goodness gracious, we've been doing it for so long. Mm. How long now? Um, I think I started in March last year. Oh, okay. So you weren't you weren't doing it for too long before I came along. Six months or so. When did you? Oh, six months or so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but you, you started watching. How long after you started watching that you started actually, like, you know? Oh, uh, we started watching, it would have been probably end of November, December last year. And then I finally actually typed something in the chat. Probably in January, February. Mm. Yeah, January. And then by the end of February, you'd had me on. Well, there you uh, go. On the stream. Well, there you go. So, yeah. I stalked, I stalked for a while. <laughs> All these quiet stalkers, you know, if you type. I don't, I, even in real life, I don't have a habit of saying something unless I've got something semi intelligible to say. Oh. And I don't like commenting on things I don't know anything about. I like encouraging people even if I don't understand what they're doing. <laughs> yeah.
Yes, yes, you were an A1 lurker. That's all right. I don't mind lurkers. You still watch. It's okay. We can't all be um, brave, I guess. But I do like the interaction of actually, you know, talking to the people who watch, getting to know you a little bit, not in the stalking way. <clears throat> I've definitely, yeah, come out of my my shell since I started being on the stream. It does help. I think this one's still trying to work on me, trying to come join um, Fridays. <laughs> Yeah, he he hasn't caved yet. He, he oh. comes home and he's like, "I'm having a day. I'm tired." No, I'm I like, can, "Come, come." The start is I can never guarantee what time I'm actually going to be home. That's okay. You just you know come around when you're ready. <laughs> you know where I am. Can you lift your arms up a bit while you're building that so I can read your t-shirt? Mine. Yes, I know it's a pl it's. It says hard Dalek, cold Dalek, little, little kid of hate, um, um, evil Dalek, Dalek, angry Dalek, exterminate. Night. Okay, thank you. I knew it was a um, soft kitty play. Yeah. I just couldn't read the yeah. couldn't read the shirt. You're gonna like one of the shirts I've got coming. Oh, okay. I had my new Pink Floyd shirt on on Friday night, and no one noticed that it had Dark Side of the Moon written on it. I did. I was ever so clever picking a shirt with dark side on it. I have thoughts inside my head that I forget to verbalize. <laughs> it's so do I, but they're often best not verbalized. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes, like, I have conversations with myself inside my head and then not realize that I've talked. I do it, don't I? Yeah. It's like, you didn't say that. It's like, yes, I did. Oh, yeah, Mel does that too. It must be a woman thing. <laughs> oh, this is heavy. Mind you, apparently us guys have an empty room in our head. An empty room? Yeah, it's where we go. It's like when we're sitting there watching TV and you're, like, talking to us, but we're not responding. It's not because we're actually watching the movie. We've locked ourselves in this empty room that we're supposed to have in our heads, and we think of literally nothing, literally nothing. Oh, darkness, no yeah. parents. I've, 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 I spend a lot of time in my empty head, empty room in my head, apparently. Oh, Amy in the chat says, oh, ABC, same. <laughs> Maybe it is a woman thing. <laughs> oh, there you see, there you go. Well, must be. My missus does it all the time. She turns around and she goes, I told you I've got a, a meeting on at this time today. It's like, when did you tell me this? And to be fair, I do forget half the time. But, yeah, sometimes she'll say stuff. I'll go, no, 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 no. And you can tell the moment she twigs that she didn't actually tell me, she thought Sorry, of telling hey. me. And then, the to and then the topic changes, the subject changes. Or <laughs> uh, it's funny because, like, sometimes I'll have conversations with my online friends and then forget to have that same conversation with him. And I talk to him like, you know about it. And he's like, what? You didn't tell me about that. He's like, yes, I did. Friday night on the street. Oh. <laughs> I think that's the problem is that I have I have so many male you know friends that I talk to. <laughs> oh man, that sounds so bad. <laughs> What's this? Um, which is odd, as the other half of the time I inadvertently repeat myself. That would have been funny if she actually copied and pasted that straight after Douglas's post. So she repeated herself. <laughs> Repeat myself. Yeah. Repeat myself. That one is different from that one. You sure it's not just that you have to repeat yourself because your hubby's in his empty room in his head and he's not listening to you? <laughs> That's what my wife would say. I don't really go to that empty room. Oh, I do. I spend a lot of time in my empty room, but it's like I can when I'm working on my table. I'm quite often I find myself not even thinking about what I'm doing. I look back at the table, I go, "Oh yeah, that came out all right." <laughs> I'm not actually thinking about it while I'm doing it. Ah, uh, well then, it, 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 yeah, that that's something that I do. I tune out. Apparently, apparent, apparently, apparently. 
Because women don't never, they, women never stop thinking. Apparently, you're always worried about something or thinking about something, or so constantly. I'm, 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 Whereas the male brain's completely different. We can actually, yeah. we basically hibernate. Apparently, so, sometimes I'm so quiet for a long time that it goes, "Hello." <laughs> I've found myself over the years going walking into the um, walking into whatever room Mel's in and go, "Did you say something?" Just to get her to say something. <laughs> <laughs> You're evil. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. She'll go, no. Oh, okay. And I'll walk back out again. But it's like, oh, at least you've spoken. Uh, I know you're breathing. Off to work. Bye, Flash Pills. Have there fun at work. See you, Flash. Cheers for having a look for that part for me. And for finding the Jubex. Mm, ooh, gold. Yeah, I know. You get a whole bag of stuff and you can bet you're only using one of those pieces. <coughs> oh, this black one's going to weigh a ton. Because, like, these packets come with a set arrangement of pieces. And sometimes, you know, you only use one bit. I think this one uses a cross piece. Uh, oh, yeah. is that like your packet of... Um... Uh, mechanics tools or something. Yeah. You don't yeah. actually need them all, gold. but it gives them to you anyway. Yeah, and pearlescent gold. And pearlescent gold. Is quite cool. Nice. You got like a wrench and. Well, a, that's what you need to keep your eye out for for that silver part. An oil can, a um, drill. Um, a little yeah, it's your basic toolkit. Thing. It should be a monkey like wrench, a hammer, screwdriver, drill, oil squirty bottle thing. Yep. Um, uh, crowbar, possibly. No, no crowbar. Um, just trying to think what I've got uh, on my uh, mechanics wall in my that thingy that you do up nuts with. On monkey. The car. Oh, um, 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 yeah, the the cross thingy. thing, yeah. yeah. The cross spanner or whatever. The will not will not spanner. Yeah. Will not spanner. Will not spanner thingy. I think that's the. Point. Oh, cheers, Flash! If you're still there. But yeah, um, I don't think I've seen them in Pearlescent <coughs> before, so that's nice. Mm. Come back here. Interesting how it comes in a bag that has all these little holes. On. Oh, damn, Bailey, now I'm yawning. And I have to stay awake because I've got to go and get Mel from work. At least you're old, whereas Bailey is not. Hey! <laughs> Calm down. He was trying to say he was old and like, oh my God. Not old yet. Not old at all. He's old. What does that make me? <laughs> Makes me ancient. Anyone got use for a Technics wheel? A giant Technics wheel? Oh, the size of the thing. Oh, my gosh. Came in a bulk lot, though. Don't, <laughs> I don't collect said, wheels. Diggler said, pimped tools for a pimped banter chop shop. <laughs> <laughs> I'll make my brick made banter and I'll put a wheel on the back on, instead of one of the legs. Remember when I got these three and I, and I promised that they'd never see the inside of my store? They haven't. They're still here. What are they? From your mommy. Oh, those things, yes. Yeah. I promised they'd never see the inside of my shop. They haven't. They're my own personal little collection. They're useful things. I don't know yet because I haven't used any of them, but they're not going in my store. <laughs> There's no way in hell. There's something that's going in my little personal box. They're good for trees. Oh, I'd never want to make another tree in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love the way they look, but no. Nah. It's like, near my trees, trees suck. Ugh. Doing my head in every time I try and move that mock. Uh, Adam, you say that sleep is for the week. Okay, I need sleep because I need to work tomorrow in the secure dementia wing. So I need to be awake enough to not be hit. Oh, or, good, 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 so. or taken by surprise. Oh, shiny. Yeah, lots of shiny. <gasps> shiny. That's pretty. Oh, the black line is the best line out of all of them. Oh, it's the leader line. It's no, it's because it's black. I don't. Yeah, it's black. That's the only reason. The only way it could be better is if it had an, an, had an arch window attached to it. Oh, 
I need. Oh, that's the middle of the thing. I'm using the wrong tiny bits. Dude. Okay, people in the chat, arch window, round window, or square window? For what? If if you know what I'm talking about, you'll know how to answer. Um, uh, I think... No, you're not allowed to say. I want to see if anyone actually knows. Well, what were the options again? Round, uh, round window, square window, and arch window. You see... I get the reference. Uh, oh, Flash Pants is still there. No, I'm not on Instagram, Flash. Yeah. Play school's the reference. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I think they've got another window that you pick from now. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah I think the can... poor old arched window got got gypped so much in that show. That was the window I always voted for as a kid. Oh, there's a diamond window now. Oh God, a diamond Your window. Are forever. Where'd the diamond come from? Yeah, arch. That's it, Amy. Arch, arch window. There's only one window. The arch window. Poor old arch window got duped so much. I remember actually getting upset about them diamond. picking the round and square window all the time. Five nine. As a kid. No oh. shirt, Sherlock. I'd have to say you mean it's going to be? You're going to have to wait a whole week to finish it. <laughs> <laughs> or do or, it on the Friday or, night stream. You or. can come on the Friday night stream. And <laughs> count. Well, it depends on what happens. Things, huh? <laughs> well, certain things happen. I may have to work a bit longer on Friday. Yeah, you can just. You can wait a week and finish it next week. Yeah, yeah, we'll just make you wait, right? Mm. Well, I've got to wait until, until I can buy that X-Wing on the special so I can build that next week. Mel's going to kill me. Where am I going to fit next week? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I've got to stop buying Lego. No, no. no I've got to buy more shells. That's what I've got to do. Yeah. Oh. Hey, Iceberg. Hey, Iceberg. Aussie fam. We was building a Voltron, and he won't let me build any of it. So I'm sitting here like a third wheel. I mean, a fifth wheel. They are at Bragg at the moment. Oh, what do you, what do you, what, what, what? Oh, Amy was saying there's also a diamond window now, but she would have, she used to pick Arch. And she said they, they are at Bragg at the moment. Both the old and the new ones. Yeah. <laughs> I never actually watched Romper Room as a child, but my wife did, and she's and yeah, her name never got called out by the stupid thing by the stupid B either. So, yes, Douglas, I do actually understand where you're coming from, from my wife telling me about the same thing. Yeah. Uh, Iceberg reckons Voltron's much too good to share <laughs> with Cherie doing any of it. <laughs> That's exactly why Sean's not letting her do any of it. I'm not allowed to share. All right, uh, Philip, I'm going to... Send you something that is from okay. Flash Pants. He says he has two of them in his cart at the moment. Ooh. Ooh. He says, um, I have two of the balloons in my cart if he wants them. Winky face. Depending on the price. 
I couldn't see it on the on the big screen. I'll have a look at it on here, see if I can make it out. Uh, GBP point eight eight four. No, I won't worry about it at the moment. Th thank you, Flash, but no, I'll give that a miss at the moment. I've got other stuff I really should be worrying about before I worry about getting those. But thank you. But, yeah, no, I'll give that a miss. That's the sort of thing that if it comes up, I'd, I'd jump on it if it came up locally, but... Yeah, something I should probably just not worry too much about at the moment. Uh, okay, that is sent. Hey, nerd bricks up. Yeah, we're getting to to the time of the night where all the American stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean it was saying uh, Bundaberg Regional Art Gallery. That's what Bragg was. Ah. Uh. I don't know anything about Bundaberg. I've only been here 20 years. <laughs> Jiggler said, try having an uncommon name. Yes, I know that feeling. Yeah, that's what I was saying before. And never hearing your name that hurt as a child. I feel your pain. Yeah. My missus used to go, said she went through the same thing too. Ah. Okay, Flashman says, okay, well, the offer's there if you ever want them. Um, no worries. Thank you. He likes uh, helping out fellow apples. That's very nice of you, Flash Pants, if you're watching this back yes, later. That's what I said before. I Thank you. But... Yeah. So this? Amy says, talking about carts, I've not actually purchased from Bricklick yet. I've used Brick Owl a number of times. Ooh, that's interesting. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of um, Bundaberg locals use um, things like Bragg and, and different um, synonyms for different places in town and stuff in town. It's like, I just go, huh? Like, what the heck are you talking about? I don't even know the street that my, where my wife's work is. I just, know how to get, I just know how to get there and back home again. That's all I care about. 20 years in Bundaberg, and I think I know the street names of four streets, and that's it. I was kind of the same in Gympie. You just you just know your way around. You just yeah. Know names. It's funny because you know you get backpackers will stop you and I say, oh, do you know where you know East um, East End Backpackers is? And it's like well, probably over East Bundy, I'm guessing. You just go. Don't ask, don't ask me exactly where, but and I could even be wrong. But it's probably over at West Bundaberg. No one would know. So yeah, I don't, I'm not the person to ask for directions right. around Bundy. You know how to use Google Maps. Even when you guys told me where you were staying at the motel, I didn't even realise it's the one over the road from my house. <laughs> yeah, you're special. Oh, yeah. Amy says, it's... I feel that's shocking. <laughs> it's called not caring about where you live. I'm not from here. Um, and no matter how long I live here, I'm never going to be considered a local. Not in my head anyway. I will. <clears throat> Overhead cam is out of commission yeah, again. It's died. Yeah. I was going to say before, why don't you have a charger hooked up to it? But it's an uh, Apple. It's yeah, it, it's the whole Apple thing. Stupid mm -hmm. Apple. Well, at least tonight I haven't been um, physically abusing my poor brick separator. Physically <laughs> abusing? <laughs> well, someone commented on Friday night, or was it last build night, last Tuesday? Um, I was sitting here fiddling with my um, brick separator. I, I fiddle when I don't have something to do. Mm. I've been fiddling with a pen, Lego pieces, that wheel. I can't help it. I have a non-nervous disposition, but, yeah, I, I can't sit can't still. sit still. It does my head in to sit still. Uh, I have a feeling we're going to finish at the end of this unless you yeah. want to finish without me. No. It's like, no thanks. I probably shouldn't stay up too late either. It's a two-week build. <laughs> everyone everyone who's in the chat now has to log on next Tuesday to see Sean Rock up going. <laughs> 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 I've 
fucking building with throw rules. It's like, oh, I, I need to build it. I need to finish it. <laughs> hey, boss, finish it. Ah. Or he finishes it on the Friday night stream. We'll see. I say, I say leave it for Tuesday. If you're savoring the build, imagine a whole week to savor just two and a half lines. Yeah, it's like you'll know everything about the yellow, blue, and black line by next pretty week. Kitty. <laughs> Such a pretty kitty, pretty kitty. Yeah, just pretty. don't do what you did to the yellow kitty. They don't like that. What this? Don't no. <laughs> hey, you said don't do it, so. All I heard was do it. Where's the button that says that sets an R rating to the video? <laughs> what? It's Lego. It's not a real cat. <laughs> oh, poor Lego cat. <sighs> Speaking of Lego cat, what are you doing in here? <laughs> Probably got the right cat. <laughs> Uh, he's been he's allowed back in now as long as he behaves himself. Come on, Sergey. Every time he comes in, I look down and make sure the emperor's still there. <laughs> no eating the emperor. There's everybody. Hello. Hey, Sergey. Oh, careful! Where are you going? Can't hear us. Don't walk on the keyboard. Don't you dare. That could be interesting. No walking on the keyboard. You want your draw out? There you go. <laughs> he's like his cat bed. He's like good slave. Well done. Just gotta watch what he does when he's up here. <laughs> no, usually he falls asleep. He's like, now nah, I can reach all the things. My plan is working. Building Ooh, oh, humans oh, trust oh, again. Oh. <laughs> Lull you in a false sense of security, and then the emperor's gone again. No, that won't happen. Not again. No, he's probably iron. Well, you won't do that again, will you? At least he didn't go after Darth. <laughs> you could activate the actual changeover part of the thing, and you could take Anakin. You can rack off with him. I don't care about him. <laughs> Just don't hurt Darth or the emperor. Um, didn't Anakin become Darth Vader? No, the name Anakin has no meaning to me. <laughs> <laughs> Anakin's just the whiny version of Darth. That's where you I see that you can see where Luke got it from. Like father, like son. Yeah. <laughs> no, Anakin is not Vader. Anakin. It was funny. Mel was um, Mel found a um, a folder with a whole bunch of um, collectible trading cards. Oh, actually, collectible. Um, what were they called? Uh, they were CCGs back in the day. I can't think of what that stood for. Um, and they're Star Wars collectible trading cards from an old game made by a company called Decipher. And on the cards, they had a little blurb up the top of the card about whatever was on the card. And on the C3PO card, it says that he's 200 years old. It's like, he can't be because that means Anakin was 200 years old when he became Vader. <laughs> <laughs> it's like okay well i hope i can still have twins when i'm 200 actually no hell no <laughs> maybe his components were 200 years old no no two, c3po is 200 years old c3po was created by anakin yes uh, i know this i'm informing sherry oh uh, that's why it's funny because it's so wrong Uh, what's wrong? What's going on? Gimpy Mary. Yeah, I haven't looked at Brickell, and I really don't want to set up a second shop. Yeah, honestly, I haven't really looked at Brickell either. And I don't even have a shop. Oh. Having the ones enough work, I don't need to double up on the workload. Sell something from one and, and have to go over to the other and remove it from the inventory there. No, thanks. Iceberg says he just needs some pieces that he can't get on Bricklink. Yeah, join my world, Iceberg. <laughs> and if you can't get them and you're in the States, you're in trouble. Mm. 
Maybe I could get the ones he needs. He can get me the tan bananas. <laughs> we can trade. <laughs> I said, you, you missed all the fun stuff at the start of the stream when Bailey was on. You'll ha you'll have to go back and watch it an on another time. Yeah, with these Galador. Yeah, talking Galador. Talking Galadors. Mm, I'm not yawning. No, I didn't see that. Mm. I actually tempted to go get an ice cream. Yeah. Will anyone notice I was gone? <laughs> It'll be quiet. Be quiet <laughs> the sounds of our concentration. <laughs> clicking and concentration. Yeah, um, the shoulders are quite complex. Yeah, I get me started on complex. Complex. Hi, Miss Amby. Sure, you'll be back momentarily. She's getting ice cream. She needs a sugar hit to stay awake. I'm taking too long, apparently. Got a mini. Yeah, you know, what's Amy saying? Now that I've seen how many Qlug and friends, i.e. Iceberg, are on Bricklink, I'm keen to support the team. Well, that's nice. Thank you. Oh, that's cool. I have a... Not sure how many of us actually have stores on there. I know I do, but I don't know. Dolce you know, Dolce. Sure doesn't. It's a little Ooh. mini Mini magnum. Mini magnum. Mini magnum. So a not-so-magnum. Yes, it is that time of night, Amy. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, you know, um, I... I uh, rushed having dinner to get ready for the stream so this is like oh, look it's a biscuity one oh. i don't have unhealthy ice cream he says holding up his ice break ice coffee two liter bottle <laughs> <laughs> uh hello vincenzo oh my god I know, I just made it. <laughs> just completely mutilate the poor person's name. Mm. Oh, I've got caramel ice cream. And I've got a biscuit piece of that. I have no idea how to say that second that second name. Isn't it Vincenzo? Isn't the Vince uh, Ch sound? Vincenzo. Vincenzo. I think. Mm. And I've got no idea. That surname might as well be Apple. Apple. <laughs> There's no way I'm going to even guess at what C E C E, how to pronounce that. But my, oh, I, <laughs> I always say my apologies for mangling your name. Yeah. On the upside, it makes everyone look at the live chat and see what the name was. Yeah. It's like, what's that name? Sure, he can't say this time. <laughs> this is so tiny, but it's so tasty. Mm. The only ice cream I have in this house is Skinny Cow, the sugar free ice cream. That's funny. Considering that you're drinking ice break from a two liter bottle. <laughs> I went off iced coffee a couple of weeks ago and then something happened and I needed to calm down about something. So I went and grabbed an iced coffee. A sugar-free iced coffee, I might admit. I didn't even know they'd made them. And, um, well, it's not fully sugar-free. It's 30% less sugar. And, um, yeah, that started me all over again. <clears throat> it used to be worse with Coke, but I actually did get over Coke and had enough. Uh -huh. Amy says, I half fail. I am pharmacist at Bundy's Original Diabetes Pharmacy. <laughs> this break is me break job. In the job. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Amy, which which pharmacy? I wonder if you might know my wife <laughs> through through work. Depends on which pharmacy you're with, I guess. 
I'm not sure which pharmacy her work uses. And no rain here, Adam. It looked like it wanted to, but it, it kept building up and building up. And just as it got dark, it was looking a bit yick. But nothing's happened. Not that I'm aware of, anyway. It definitely rained here today. Yeah? Oh, half your luck. <clears throat> it wasn't like all day long. It was sort of no. a shower and then that was it. No, oh, like what we had the other day, like 15 minutes of the worst, most dismal amount of precipitation and then it all blew away it's like oh wacko <laughs> that's not gonna help like, ripped off where's my rain we need two days of of constant rain but not cyclonic rain just two days of drizzling rain would be perfect soaky rain i'll have to ask my wife if she deals with you guys amy I won't say on here where she works or anything. I'll just ask her if she deals with that pharmacy. Small well. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Small well. Yep. I thought Amy's name looked familiar. Now I know why it looks familiar. Because <laughs> now you've got a stalker, Bill. <laughs> no, I'm. 99% sure, and I'm checking now before, just in case she's not, but the name seems familiar to me. She's got to be in our in our local um, Lego group. She must be. There's one Amy, but it's not the right one. She's got to be. The name seems familiar to me for some reason. <laughs> Amy says, I'm famous. Okay. She's not coming up on the group. Different. Ah, okay. So yeah, you're in the um must the wide bay Lego group, Facebook group, yeah? Okay, that's cool then. Same first name. And that way I know who you are then. If it's the same first name, then it's the only one of that name in the group. So Yeah, I think we've had this conversation before. Her last name's different on YouTube. Ah, uh, there you go. For okay. reasons. Yeah, how's that? Hey, Bundy Show. Yep, there you go. Okay, cool. Yeah, first day of the Bundy. That was weird, though, that little weather front that came through that first day of the Brick event in Bundy. Mm. That was the weirdest thing, like that really heavy fog and then the rain and then nothing. And all it did was turn the day into a sweat box. Yeah, isn't that a normal day in Bundy? Yeah, but not with the rain. The rain hasn't, that sort of rain and that wasn't normal. And we've had nothing since. Nothing okay. we're talking about. We have oh, finished. He's, he's a bit more chunky, isn't he? Yeah, he's massive. He's still only about half built. Wow. Have we got, so there's the, the torso of. That makes sense. Yeah, I'm not too sure how these. These probably obviously fold back somehow. I have to look in the instructions and I go. Mm. He'll have to look in instructions. Yeah, there's even a whole book just to tell you how to um put all the lines together. No, the black line's huge. Mm. It's got proper proper rotating shoulder joints. Mm. So obviously, the other two lines are going to click here and on that side. Yeah, this isn't going to do any mental damage to poor old Sean having to wait a week to finish this. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> You'll probably try and drag me on Friday night. <laughs> You'll probably be barging her out of the way. Come on, woman, move. I want to get this built. <laughs> well, that may depend on what certain things happen. Yeah, it depends oh, on work. Yeah. Man, it's taken us so long to build Ninjago City in the dogs. Could have been started this last week, but yeah. never mind. <clears throat> oh, no, my wife doesn't watch these streams. Mm. So, what is our thought so far of oh, the lines we've built? Fun. This is such an awesome build. And the black one's so big. Yeah. That's I've still got his said. legs and then... <laughs> What's going there? 
<laughs> Starting to give you an idea of probably how tall it's going to be. Yeah. There's obviously a bit of height to more it. Do it. Yeah, it's a bit, yeah, there's a bit more to it than I thought. The back legs of the black line, which will slip into the, the holes. Clickety clack, clack, clack. Oh, I'm a meanie. <laughs> no. Anticipation. Anticipation. Okay, so we're stopping about exactly halfway through Voltron. Yeah. Stay tuned for the next time. Next us week us. <laughs> we are here every Tuesday night having some good couple bonding time building yeah. Lego. In this case, he builds Lego and I watch him. <coughs> <laughs> and uh, it's always fun to hang out with our Lego friends oh, too. Yeah. Thanks for joining us, uh, <sighs> Dark Side. Mm. Not a problem. Always yeah. here. Always happy to be here. Always. Always. And, of course, um, thank you very much for our special guest, Bailey, who yeah, was great in for a while. You, Bailey. Don't get to hang out often enough, but, mm. you know, you get that when you don't live in the same town. Yeah, or even the same. Yeah, not even the same postcode. Not even slightly <laughs> the same postcode. All right. Well, um, thank you, everyone, who's joined us in the live chat. Mm -hmm. It has been a fun night. Oh, yeah. Look forward to finishing this one. Mm. So. If we can move on to something else. Uh, if you have an opinion on what we should build next, um, we have a lot of like the recent sets, um, modulars, and well, we've got some new Minecraft. If yeah, anyone would like to see Minecraft, so Minecraft sets. if you have some suggestions, <laughs> um, <laughs> comment, comment below. And well, uh, I suggested that she could start building that this week. Yeah, maybe. I mean, it's only. I just want to see her build it because yeah, that I'm... was my that was my birthday present last year. We <laughs> it about this time last year. It's nearly my birthday again. I just want to see how that. many spare uh, wood wooden planks you get in it. Spare wooden planks, huh? I don't think it'll be. Yeah. I don't think that will be. Yeah, it's got to be one. Just one. It's <laughs> like I need one. Just one. I need yeah. one. God damn it. I could probably I could probably hook you up with a different colour. That anyway, probably wouldn't look that bad actually. Anyway, we can talk about this after the yes. show. Yep. So um yeah. Uh if you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscription um button. Make sure so, you hit the notification bell. Yeah, yeah, especially if you watch on mobile, uh it'll give you a notification. And uh until Friday when we have TDI Friday. Keep on building, guys, and uh, we'll see you then. See you.